Hello there guys and welcome back for the fourth day of Extra Life week. Uh, today we are going to be playing Tomb Raider and uh, what's the name of this one? Curse of the Sword? Curse of the Sword? You know I've forgotten already. It's the second Tomb Raider Game Boy game though. It's very similar to the previous one. Very similar from what I've seen of, from testing it and stuff like that. Uh, I've been looking forward to playing this because I could definitely go for more of the gameplay from the previous one. Yeah, this is, uh, we're doing all this for Extra Life. It's uh, Boston Children's Hospital that we're raising for. There'll be a few links coming up if, um, when you don't mind posting some, post them over to YouTube and that, Extra Life, there we go. And uh, yeah, for anyone who's watching, even if you haven't donated, there is a secret raffle going on because I'm doing this as part of uh, Team Tomb Raider, Team Tomb Raider community. And uh, yeah, you can partake in that you got one free entry but if you donate for every ten dollars you got another entry so yeah just want to say a big thank you to everyone who's uh, helped me raise so far we're now nearly past the point we were uh we finished on last year because i think we raised one thousand one hundred and fifty dollars last year we're nearly past that we're actually nearly past that with one donation we could be past that you know now today uh, but yeah, we haven't even got to the main event yet, so, uh, we're doing really well. We're doing really, really well. So, um, game is 300 hours long. Please don't troll me. Uh, I, the first one was longer than I thought it would be. If you're just wondering why I look like I've been crying or anything like that, I dressed up yesterday and put on a lot of eyeliner and stuff like that. It's not come off properly, as you can probably tell. My eyebrows look blacker than usual. My eyes do. I look like I haven't slept much. Uh, yeah, it brings... <laughs> It brings out your eyes. <laughs> um, but also my face is paler because the white face paint wouldn't quite come off. This is the shirt I was going to wear yesterday as well, for the record. The one that got um, blue screened out, even though it's green and purple. Makes no sense. Anyway, let's uh, let's get into this game. Like I said, I did a little bit of testing on it and uh seemed pretty fun for the most part. I didn't play too much of it, though. I just wanted to make sure it was working. Well, oh, thank you. There we go. It looks blue to you, does it? It's per that this is purple here. There's a little bit of black and then green bits here. There's no there's no blue. Hello there, Kangorf. Welcome back. Good to see you. Yes, I needed some makeup wipes, I really did, but I don't have any, so uh yeah. I haven't bought any in years because I don't really put makeup on that frequently anymore, so yeah, I used to be one of those eyeliner boys back in the day, back in my teenage years. Yeah, Tomb Raider Curse of the Sword, I was right, there we go. Okay, so, uh, let's start a new game. We've got a fantastic picture of Lara doing a bit of a... Mmm, mmm, I wonder, I wonder why. She's trying to look sexy. Oh, what's going on here? Someone's melting. Summoning something. Soon, master. Okay. I guess that's him talking. Anything to add to this? Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. Sorry, I keep press pressing start. Oh. About to kiss it, maybe? Who knows? Soon, you will be free. I'm sure. What's that say? Pervex, uh, seven Okay, it's gone. Free once again. New York, Museum of An Antiquities. I nearly said antiques there. Okay, Laura and someone on the right is looking at something, a golden dagger of some variety. Laura, it's wonderful. It's a wonderful piece, Jane. Where did you acquire it? Right, Jane. It was found in a shipwreck off the coast of Florida. Plenty of pirates there, I'm sure. We believe it was used in rituals of dark magic, and of course, Laura's gonna go find someone and sacrifice him now. Jane, not Jane, oh no, it, it's Jane, it's Jane. Janeway, <laughs> yes. I don't think, I don't think they quite loot the same. What the? Is, is, is the uh, ellipsis there in replacement of something, I wonder? <laughs> What's going on, are they doing a little dance? I'm gonna guess they've been knocked over or something. Watch out, Jane! Ah, oh, Laura, Laura's tackling Jane out of the way of this man, this menace who has emerged behind them, and now he's just strutting the fuck out of there. He's like, yeah, my job is done here. We're going. Laura, he's stealing the sword! Oh, no. It's not like you could shoot him or something like that. Oh, little jog after him. Oh, my God, this is ridiculous. Look at the... 
What's he doing? He looks like he's doing dance in the distance or something. Don't worry, Jane. I'll get them. Of course you will. Oh no! I haven't got my <laughs> It's not like... Good luck, Laro. It's not like, oh, I, I left them at my... Uh, I, like, I dropped them or something, or they got taken away. It's this time, it's just, oh, I, I forgot my guns today. Oh, no. Uh, of course it is. Door is locked. Oh, right, okay. We uh, This is interesting. Got, like, some text at the bottom and stuff. A dinosaur exhibit. I saw this. Oh, God, yeah, I forgot one thing. She farts when she moves. We're gonna have to get used to this, I'm afraid. You can just hear her, like, sort of, uh, at least they actually have some kind of sound effect now, instead of it being completely silent, but yeah. yeah there's a giant dinosaur. It's probably gonna come alive and munch on it. It's gonna be the final boss, isn't it? This is like my mother. How dare you? Uh, right, so maybe I can hop over there. All I did when I tested it was just run around this area. I'd barely even, like, made any, excuse me, made any progress. Can I not grab onto that? Lara. What the heck? Do you, do you want to maybe get up there? That 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 would be nice. Do I need to press something different to grab onto this? Okay, clearly she doesn't want to. Dinosaur exhibit, right? Okay, so can we open this one? Oh, there's a lever there. Lift not working, of course. I'm gonna guess there was supposed to be an is there, but they couldn't fit on the screen. Oh, right. Okay, so we need to go up there by looks. Hello. Oh, I can't. I don't have guns, do I? What what? <laughs> Hello there, Rep. Welcome back. Um, can, can I maybe like, um, yeah, she isn't American. She've got, oh, I think he's like an invisible wall, actually. He pistol whipped me to, okay, let's not do that again. We'll go the other way. Now, fuck off, Lara. He, he has no interest in coming after us or anything like that. He's just there to stop us from going through, apparently. Right, let's, um, let's go up this way. Okay. God's a dicks, by the way. I, I could see that. Uh, over this way. I is he supposed to be the museum god? Mind you, why would he have a shield like that? Just come from, like, Rome or something like that in order to defend this museum. Right, so let's head over this way. I, I don't know. I don't know why he's here now. I'm gonna guess he's part of the, um... Uh, like, uh, uh, in allegiance with the guy who decided to knock them both over and take the sword, or something like that. He's preventing us from going that way. Right, so we've got a large med kit. The first of a million. Oh, she's not making a, ah, uh, sound anymore. So we've got we to gotta put up with ping every time, the, you know, that happens. Uh, yes, there is a T-Rex. I don't know why. Right, over this way. Uh, they just want to remind people of what this museum is actually keeping. <laughs> Make the R self uh, sound yourself. Welcome back, C. But yeah, every time she picks it up, I just need to go, aha. Uh -huh. All uh, right. So over to the right. Just keep going up. There's always a Rex. Yeah, we're gonna have to fight it later, probably. Like I said, uh, up we go. Alright, so we can go right, we can go left. There is a lever that's back there. I like the way the camera pans over and shows you what- Oh, look at that! That's so much better than the previous game already. Because it, it allows you to be not as misled, if you get what I mean. I wonder what the fall damage is like in this. Okay, pretty non-existent, as per the previous one. So, we just want to go down one more level. That's so much better, though. That's so much better. We're gonna get lost a lot less in this, probably. Right, so door key. Aha! Uh -huh. And off we go. Oh! I forgot something. I forgot something, guys. Ta-da! I said I'd do it. There you go. Enjoy yourselves. Don't abuse it. <laughs> well, it's only my mods that can. Yeah. Oh, yeah, hold on a second. I need to actually make it function by putting that up first, don't I? There we go. It should be working now. If you want to do a quick test of it, go ahead. Uh, just to make sure. Just have one def and then remove it. Def, uh, 1300... Is it not doing anything? Oh. Is it not working? Wait, why, why isn't it working? Hold on a second. I, I think I know why it isn't working. Just give me a sec. Try now. Try now. I know, it's broken. Go on, give it another go. 
Yeah, there we go. It's working now. Cool. Okay, so we got another guard over this direction. Uh, I, I, I'm not, I'm not going to go try run into him or anything like that again. So let's just keep going this way. Oh, wait a second. What? Did we encounter a door and I just forgot about it already? Uh, hmm. Well, I'm not going to be able to get over that way, am I? I'm glad you enjoyed my Tomb Raider 3 video. <laughs> it's been a long time since I recorded that. It feels more recent than it actually is. Uh, I think it's like four or five years ago now. It's ridiculous. Time, like, flies. It really does. Squeak, 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 squeak. Right, nothing over this way. I haven't seen a door that we could- Oh, maybe the door at the bottom, yeah. Use the key on that door. What? What? No, the one at the beginning, right? The one at the very beginning? You're kidding. Wait, what? Right, go. I, I was busy with the death count, okay? That's my excuse. That was a broken lift. I thought there was one right at the very beginning, like next to where um, Jane was. Am I wrong? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. The one that's next to Jane. That That's the one I'm thinking about. No, you're not wrong. What? Okay. Y you're confusing me now. Sorry. So that's the only door I recall there being- Oh god, she takes a bit more fall damage in this game. We want to be a little bit more care- We want to be a little bit more careful, I guess. How's the sound for you guys, by the way? I might turn it down a little bit just so, um... Just to protect your ears on the louder bits, if there are any in this game. I have it the same volume I had the previous game. Right, okay, so can we get through here then? Yes, okay, good. Danger, danger. High voltage, uh, but like... What, is it just gonna zap me as I walk through? No, okay, what's down here? Oh, is that dangerous? I, I can't tell if that's actually going to be dangerous or not. I, I don't want to walk in it, really, but at the same time, I think I kind of need to. I'll tell you what, let's just go up here first, see if uh, we get zapped. No, we don't. Okay, that's good. I thought for a moment it was just going to electrocute us to death, but... Oh no, a rat! Okay, let's keep going. We don't need to stop here by the looks of it. When we touch, when we kiss, when we touch... Yes. Hello there, Keladin. Welcome. Uh, drop me a message on Discord whenever you can, Keladin. Right. Let's keep going to the right. I think maybe we can get through this door? No, we can't. Okay, let's keep going that way then. Down we go. Yeah, I didn't get time to uh, bleach my hair and all that, but I will do so tonight. First save. Good. Uh, so that we can put the die on that one the vote that I was doing. Hello there, Ludia. Welcome back. How are you doing? Uh, right, so that's going to electrify that. D what? But then how are we... Well, we can jump across, can't we? Uh, can we go over here? No. Okay. A black outline. Yes, she did. I think it's pretty much exactly the same model as before. I'm doing good, thank you very much. How's it going for you? Uh, let's... Let's just run and jump over to the other side if we can. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Why did you grab onto that? Maybe I should have pressed that a bit later. Oh, right, okay, so it's only a little bit of it that's actually electrified. Uh, this doesn't seem safe at all, but it's only electrified for a short period of time, isn't it? So, um... Right. So when it goes through... Okay, go, go, go. Oh fuck, I landed directly on it. Uh, right. Stop! Okay, go, 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 go. Of course they do, Mag. Don't be silly. Oh god, I'm nearly dead. Hello there, Matt Metal. Welcome back. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. We're, we're, we're just alive. Just alive, pretty much. Uh, let's use the full heal. So, uh, what's that done then? I guess we go back in here. Let's have a chat to Jane, see if she says anything. No, she's just gonna stand there with her, um... Wow. She looks completely soulless, doesn't she? Uh, I'm sorry, Jane. Would you get much stares from people in public uh, when you when they see your exotic hair colors? Well, I actually normally wear a hat in public, so it's not a big deal, really. But probably. I don't know. I think you guys know what colours won anyway. Oh, the lift! The lift will work now, won't it? So we can go up there. Uh-oh. 
Okay. Interesting. Yeah, the bright pink one. The bright pink one. I thought it would. I thought it would. I don't mean to say you guys are predictable or anything, but I thought it would. It got over 50% of the votes. So yeah, uh, come back in, like, on Saturday, or at least by Saturday, my hair will actually be bright pink. Uh, I've got- oh shit, don't go over there. We have the choice between um, a carnation pink and a flamingo pink. I think I'm gonna go for the flamingo, because it just seems really vibrant. I'll see how it comes out first, though. I'll put a little bit on my hair of both. Bob a gun, Lommy. Yeah, probably. <laughs> right, so we need to get up that way. Uh, we can go over to the right, though, for now. Uh, oh, you're not going to come alive and start smacking me, are you? No, having flashbacks to um, Tomb Raider Chronicles. <laughs> shield is missing. Okay, we need to get this man a shield. He's pretty. He's practically naked without it, clearly. Right. Discus thrower down here. I forgot, uh, Discus is an, uh, is a, um, Olympian sport from Rome, isn't it? So, well, a lot of the things are, actually, that we still do today. Uh, right, let's keep going down. Sorry, I mean, uh, the Romans, not Rome. Yeah, you, you, you get what I meant. Hello there, Amadeus. No, hot pink, like a BMX owned by a cool kid from the 80s. Ooh, cool. Well, it's probably going to be hot pink. I mean, like, um, that's kind of what flamingo pink is to some degree. Greece, Rome, whatever. It's the same thing, okay? Europe! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, what, what's going on? Oh, not this again. Sorry, I've got the thing. Do you remember a few streams back where I was on about how I had purge on my screen constantly? At the moment, I've got a smiley face on my screen at the moment. No, I know they're not the same thing. I'm joking, okay? <laughs> yeah, people who steal our jobs, clue. This is why we voted Brexit, <laughs> which is going out so well. <laughs> oh, God. I get sick of hearing about Brexit. I really do. It's just been on going for too long now. It really has. So I wish Theresa May would just admit defeat. Alright, oh god. Camera's still doing that thing where it just goes zooping off in a direction when you jump over things. Uh, no, no, um... I haven't seen any of it yet, Matt Metal, but we will be playing it on Sunday. I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, you found it a bit underwhelming? Okay, that's a shame. I've heard of uh, mixed things. Some people saying they fuck. No, that's not what they said. Um, saying that they really enjoyed it and others saying it was a bit underwhelming, so yeah. At least a bit underwhelming as opposed... Wow, we just murdered the guy. A bit underwhelming as opposed to, um, you know, people saying, oh, it sucked or something like that, if you get me, so... Right, down we go. The murder has started, yes. As, as a croft, we must murder everyone in existence, pretty much. Right, so we can grab that and we can grab the shield, cool. It's already overloading us with med packs. <laughs> I think anyone talking about Brexit would bore anyone to death, so don't you worry. Right, anyway, let's, uh, I'll save the game again and we'll head over to the left. We need to find where our shield friend was, he wasn't too far back. Uh, I think we just need to go down here actually, don't we? No, not down there. That was just a little pitfall. I don't know why they put that there. Maybe it's just to educate you that you need to do the little hops and stuff. I don't know. I know how to do them though, so it's all good. We played the previous game. God damn it, Laura. We played the previous game, so it's all good. No, Laura. I don't talk politics much, to be honest. Like, I, I make the odd comment, but I, I don't really delve into politics anymore. I used to far more. Right, okay, so over to the left. Good times. I'm really enjoying the fact that it does show you where to go. Hello there, Alan. Welcome back. Uh, no, I haven't listened to the Tomb Raider suite. I didn't actually back it, so you, you're you here. Uh, what the fuck did... Did that actually just say you, you're here, a door open? I'm pretty sure it just said your as opposed to you. Like, how did they make that error? And why did it just say that instead of, um... Instead of actually showing us where it was? Because it, it's got... It's it's had a good track record so far. Hello there, Triple Six. Welcome back. I don't know where the door is. 
Oh, I'm just gonna have to look around, aren't I? Uh, maybe this one? Oh yeah, here we go. No, this is the elevator. Well, it allows us to go up further. Okay, let's, uh, well, we haven't been here, so this is fine. What's that? Oh, it's a, it's a bomb. Well, I know what Laura's doing after this. Uh, right, let's continue going up. Yeah, it did say your. Okay, so I, I wasn't, I, I wasn't seeing things there. Fair enough. All right. Whoa. Okay, this is a problem. He's gonna gun us to death probably. So let's take that or go down on him as it is. And oh no. Okay, we need to swing across the top. Ignore him. Just go back up, quick. There we go. Of course, when we're above people, they can't see us at all in this game, so at least, you know, that was the case in the previous game, so... If only there was a foam version of this, yes. I mean, this is, this is decent quality overall. I, I do in, uh, enjoy the... Pre well, I did enjoy the previous game, and this seems to be the same formula once again, so... Okay, what's that? Cannonballs? Uh, huh. okay, Laura's carrying a heap of cannonballs. She must have good arms in this game. Though it's probably... Her muscles have probably increased tenfold from all the med packs she had in the previous game, so we can't get through here. Okay. Saw that there's an area over to the right. Uh, there's a tank from 1970s... Okay. And then an armoured vehicle. Um, yeah. Another... Oh, no! A Doberman. Well, at least it's not like the one from, um from Angel of Darkness, we'd be dead immediately. Yeah, no you don't. Uh, there we go. It just completely ignored me there. Go up. I need to destroy the world faster. Over to the right. Over men. Right, so that opened that. We can also go up. Uh, so that was down into the right, not too far. Uh, okay, another med kit, good times. And then let's get off here. And down again. And then, uh, right, over to the right hand side. This way? Oh god. She takes a fair bit of damage from falling in this, by comparison. I mean, the damage that she took before was so unrealistic, it was ridiculous. So I'm glad that they've at least... Okay, that's locked. I'm glad that they've at least changed that, because it was a bit... silly. Okay. Uh, oh, another rat. Go through. Oh, what's that? What's that? That is a... a crowbar, okay. Jump over the rat. Oh, what the heck, Laura. Okay, I don't know where we need a crowbar just yet. We can't go down here just yet, by the looks of it. There is, um... Seemingly a place for uh, things to pop out on the right hand side. Is that a left handed crowbar? Uh, yes, it is. It is actually a left handed crowbar. <laughs> I mean, like, it, it, it's facing the wrong way. Now be Gordon Freeman. Yes, I could be Gordon Freeman. My god, I need to be more careful. Um, I don't know where the name Crowbar comes from, if I'm being honest. Does anyone, uh, have any idea, like, why a Crowbar is called a Crowbar? I actually don't know myself. Surely that red's head would have exploded from Laura jumping on it. Yeah, but hey. Laura weighs nothing, so... Right, did we come this way? Oh no, I'm getting lost now, admittedly, but let's keep going. Oh, right, this is where the elevator was. Okay, so uh, let's try going up this way, because we never came over to the right, did we? Ah, okay, we can't go there. Uh, what's that? Because it's a bar that crow... Oh, what, really? Oh, God. Fucking hell, that was loud. Sorry, firework. Perhaps due to the crowbar's resemblance of feet of crows. Ah, yeah, that makes sense. That does make a little bit of sense, actually. So we have a crowbar and we have cannonball. Um... Well, keep an eye out for a cannon, keep an eye out for, uh, you know, like, the possibility of um, opening something with a crowbar, guys. Because uh, so far I haven't spotted anything myself. Kaladin, did you get what I said earlier on about uh, keep uh, checking out Discord? Oh, fuck. 
Uh, maybe we need to blow this guy's head off with the... <laughs> no, I don't think that's gonna work. Right, we have plenty of medkits, we don't need to worry about this, but we should be careful of, uh... You know, the amount of damage that we're taking from him. I think it might be best I go, um, onto another floor instead. There was a door you missed. Maybe we could pop it open with the crowbar. I don't know. Where was that door, though? I like bananas. Give me a banana. By the Doberman. Okay. So, I need to get back up there. I suppose we just need to test out everything. My boyfriend does. I, I, okay. <laughs> Hello, frog. Right over... Up, up, up. Bananas are gross, how dare you. <laughs> Love a good banana. Uh, right, we can't get in there. I already checked that out. Yes, I ate all the banana cake. I loved it. Thank you. Uh, right. I don't see a door near this Doberman. Am I missing something? Oh, what's that? Hello, Nero... Zanola? Uh, is that someone here, or am, am I missing something? Well, welcome. It sounds like some kind of medication, though. <laughs> It's Alonzo Ryan backwards. Oh. Oh, this door. Yes, yeah, sorry. I'm blind. Uh, can we not use the crowbar on it, Laura? No. No, she doesn't want to use the crowbar on it. That's disappointing. I mean, yeah, she could try at least. Throw a cannonball at it? <laughs> she could be like that guy from One Piece. You never know. Yeah, that guy. Alright. Well, let's get back down again. Oh, no. Want to do a running jump here, don't I? Use the crowbar on the dog. Yeah. Run around with the crowbar, just bat everything to death. I can't be good. What the fuck? Why didn't you take damage from that? Throw the cannonballs at your enemies. Yeah, she's carrying around five whole cannonballs. Has anyone ever lifted a cannonball before? Laura is carrying five of them at the moment. I mean, I, I suppose they do vary on size, but still. They are pretty fucking heavy. Alonzo Orion, the Irish equivalent. Yeah, I like that. Well, we know Laura is just the epitome of strength, so, you know. Uh, can she go up any further? No, we got to go back down. Wow, this is already a bit confusing. So, look out for a place where we can use a crowbar, where we can use a cannonball. I'm going to guess there'll be somewhere down here that we can do that with, but... Yeah, like, uh, oh no, not there. Uh, not a whole lot, Frog Radar. We've just been wandering around a museum. Laura has a friend called Jane. They both got kind of knocked out of the way and, like, an artifact was stolen from this museum that we're in at the moment, which is possibly one of the most intricate museums ever, and I don't know how the fuck tourists get around it, but let's not question it. Um, no, we already came here, didn't we? Chris Redfield, of course. Nope, oh, shit. Uh, right, we can go in there, can't we? Was this open before? I don't recall coming here, actually. Hmm. No, I did come here. Yeah, I remember now. Up we go. I'll, I'll check the top first, and we'll just work our way down. Yeah, yeah, you, you gotta be at the pinnacle of fitness in order to get around this museum. It's how they reject people at the door, you know. Uh, do you think you can handle our museum? Do you think you can actually handle our museum? I don't think you can handle our museum, so yeah, get the fuck out of here. Don't even pay for a ticket to get in. <laughs> it's the Museum of Muscle. Okay, it's not got anything to do with this, has it? No. Yes, it's a, it's a ninja warrior course. <laughs> Brilliant. One of the reasons I don't want kids museums. Oh god. 
Uh, no, this is a dead end. This was where a med kit was before. Okay, let's try going down to the bottom floor then. I think there was a couple more areas that we could check out before we go down there, but... Like I said, no cannon, no place to use crowbar. Already very, very confused. Uh, but yeah, we'll figure it out. I'm sure. Right, running jump over this way. I don't know what it is, but the um, controller seems slightly more responsive than in the previous game. I think they may have fixed something, like a, a tiny, tiny, uh, like, sort of uh, delay in the controls or something like that. There was a man who kissed a demon and called it Master. Um, they have that kind of relationship. Cut to Captain Janeway and Laura in the museum, uh, talking about the artifact. Then... Oh yeah, of course, right. It was stolen. Laura tried to shoot the thief, but she realized she's not American and can't carry her guns at all time. Yeah, pretty much. Even though apparently they're in... Wait, are they in... Eng it wasn't established where they were, was it? I remember they talked about California, but then I don't think they said they were in California. I could be wrong, but... Still, I think um, one of these, uh, one of those things in with America is you're not allowed guns in all places, are you? Like there are, I think museum would be somewhere that you're not allowed guns. I could be wrong, but I don't know. Thank you, Jen. Who cares about norm norms? Like everyone. I don't know how America works, if I'm being honest. Right, so let's go down anyway. Doesn't London only, uh, doesn't England only consist of London? Correct, it does. You're right. Uh, so I can't get over that way. But I want to take my machine gun and grocery store. How will I be able to shoot all the vegetables? <laughs> London and Nottingham. You can buy a gun in a grocery store. Is that true? I, I don't know if that's true or not. Can I get... Okay, I'll tell you what. I'm just going to fall down here. We'll, we'll check first. We'll check first to see if it's safe. Yeah, it does look like it is, but then uh, what, what? Is there any point? No, we're just going to take damage. Oh, okay, whatever. Don't matter. Let's go over to the left-hand side. Oh god. I wish my Asda sold shotguns. <laughs> uh, of course, we can get through here, but then I really don't think there was any point in going back. Was there? Because, uh, yeah, there's just... Yeah, th there's definitely no point in going in there, surely. What am I missing, then? I'm already lost. Already lost. If you guys spot anything that you think will, like, lead us to the next area or something, then uh, feel free to point it out. I'm very surprised, like, we haven't found a place to put these cannonballs. So this area is pretty much just, like, cut off from the rest of it. Do I not- can I not, like, maybe use the cannonball on this guy or something? I don't know. Like, maybe- maybe I need to trade him a cannonball for something, I don't know. Anyway, let's, uh... Let's go back up to the third floor. Because I think we've got more chance of finding something up there than we have any of the other floors, at least. <laughs> I know, it's so rude. Uh, you don't think, like, you need to use the cannonball on the tank or something weird like that? No, no. I, I, it was just a thought. It was a weird thought, but hey, you never know. This is Tomb Raider at the end of the day. Can I get up there from jumping from here, actually? I might be able to. Yeah, 1977 tank. I mean, you, haven't you ever seen a tank from 1977? I mean, uh, th this is what makes me think maybe we're in America. Because did we even make... Oh, I don't know. I, I don't know anything about war. I'm, I, sh I should shut up. Anal beads are like the ones around Jonah's neck. <laughs> Leave Jonah and his anal beads alone, okay? Yeah, I figured it's a need to activate the ladder. Remember that I am in the chat. No, I, I, who's in the chat? Sorry? What are you on about? Anyway, let's... Uh... Down here was the gunman, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, oh god, he just spanked us, I think. I did quite a bit of damage. Right, over to the left. Jump. I know. Just take the turret. Or the turret, as Jim would call it. Yeah, I know the UK invented tanks, but then why was one made in the 1970s that looked um, like that? I would have thought it would be a bit different. Am I wrong? 
<laughs> Thank you so much, Gennardo. Uh Five dollars. Sorry, it isn't much, but let's reach the next goal, my friend. Well, th there we go. Yeah, we've got we've raised more than last year, I think, at this point. Thank you so much, Jen. And don't worry, every little counts, of course. Unless you want to get more entries into that raffle, than it than it does. <laughs> Thank you so much to everyone who's donated. I really appreciate it. Uh, I'm not seeing anything at all. Oh, for God's sake, that is right out my window. Uh, right out my window. Right outside my window. Uh, thank you for hosting, Wind. My PayPal balance is really low at the moment. That's no problem, Jen. Don't you worry. Do not worry about that. I'm, I'm just grateful that you uh, donated at all, so don't worry. Like, every little counts, even if it's just, like, a cent or something like that, you know? I say that now, and just imagine my stream just getting spammed up with people, like, donating cents. <laughs> I mean, uh, you could do, but it'd be a lot of effort for what it's worth. Okay, there's nothing up here. I really can't see what we've got to do. Every little helps, Tesco Orion. Yeah, of course. Uh, so there's nothing down here. Well, nothing up here, should I say. Okay, drop down. I'm nearly dead again, unfortunately. So, run past the dog. This is the last place that we opened, isn't it? We cannot get in here. The door is still locked. We can head upwards. Uh, there's the rat here. There's nothing this way whatsoever. I guess all we can do is drop down into that place then, because I can't really see much else we can do. So, uh, let's do it. Okay, yeah, we've not been here before. This must be what we had to do all that time. Oh, there we go. We had a prompt there for using this artillery cannon. Okay, uh, what? Oh, I get to actually control it. Okay, so I need to know what exactly I'm shooting it at, I suppose. Uh, I have no idea. Good times. Uh, is there anything that's obvious to you guys? My eye is feeling a lot better, though. My eyes are pretty bloodshot at the moment. Yeah, from all the eyeliner I put on yesterday. Uh, no, it's not loaded. I, I'm gonna guess we load cannonballs into it. Well, there's only, um, five places we can shoot, by the looks of it. So let's try this first. Oh, we're trying to kill this guy with the cannon. Got it. So go down a little bit. And up again. Ah, oh, stalkers. Sorry to read uh, that you guys have had to deal with that. Obviously, I have as well, as uh, most of you probably are aware. Though, ah, we're nearly pushing on a year since that happened. So I don't think that's a call for a celebration, but hey. <laughs> well, let's keep going up. Because he can't hear the explosions yet, he's just going to stand there. <laughs> the fracture. <laughs> yes, uh, no, you're not supposed to put it in your eyeball. Um, definitely not the case, but uh, yeah, I kind of s screwed up a bit because I was rushing. And um, even earlier on, I put on white face paint. I don't know if you saw it yesterday. I think you might be new, so a big welcome to yourself. Um, I slapped on those white face paint for the dress up I did yesterday. And in doing my eyes, I closed it and um, then did the wrong eye. And yeah did the eye that was open, because I'm clever like that, so I slapped a load of white face paint in my eye, yeah. Uh, so, uh, I'm just very clever, that's all I can say. Needs fire exit key. Well, I think that might be the fire exit key, right? No, it isn't. Of course it isn't. So we need to find a door to use this on. Beauty Guru Alonzo, yeah, I should... I should definitely make tutorial videos, shouldn't I? On how not to put on face makeup. <laughs> I'm just very clever, don't you worry. Uh, I, do you guys remember where... Oh, the door near the Doberman. The door near the Doberman. Okay, so let's go up this way. Because I, I think this is now... Yep, there we go. We can get up here. So this will be a bit quicker, won't it? I, I, I don't know. All kinds of muse museums, triple six. Yeah, normally deactivated. Definitely. But, you know... Right, so it's this door, isn't it? Yeah, we can go in. Fantastic. We're actually making progress again. Good. This is kind of tough, admittedly. But we're getting there. We're getting there. Um, right, so we can't go over that way. 
Ah, oh, oh yeah, I've got my gun, I've got my gun. What am I doing? I just jumped on the spot, I didn't mean to do that. Like panicking. Get the guns out. Murder this man. Thank you. That is firing a lot faster than the guns in the previous game. Or the gun in the previous... I don't know if it's a single gun here. No, it's two guns. It's two guns. You can just about see it. I think the depth works a bit better in this game, actually. I think they may have made a few small improvements to her sprite. I could be wrong, but... The gun effects sound a lot better as well, actually. They don't sound as um, obnoxiously loud, at least. Oh no, no embalming fluid, please. <laughs> Shh. I'm doing great. At least I think I am. Right, down we go. And then uh, jump over to the right, left. Yep, okay. And a save, fantastic. Right. Another gap, okay. Great job, Alon uh, Alonzo. Thank you, thank you so much, Mac. I am, I'm, I'm so glad that you think I'm doing good. Oh, they die fast, don't they? Oh, god damn it! I'm gonna guess the guy with the shield. We can't actually shoot them. I, I, it's just a guess because, well, yeah, the way that they're like blocking everything. Now, isn't this back where we were before? I'm pretty sure it is, isn't it? Or am I wrong? No, no, no. We haven't been across here. At least the scenery is a bit more diverse here. We can actually tell when we haven't been to a place before. Uh, do I just drop here? Oh, fuck. What? What the hell was that all about? Um, okay, we've got to go all the way around again. I don't know what I was supposed to do there. I got a prompt to press A. Did I press B instead? I probably did press B. Because, um, the problem at the moment is I actually have... But you can knock the bomb off the... Right, that's going to blow up the floor, isn't it? Wonderful. Um, yeah, I actually have the buttons assigned to the opposite of what they are. Oh, wait, no, I don't. So I have um, B assigned to A, and then um, A assigned to X, so yeah. Thank you, Rep. Take care. I'll hopefully see you again tomorrow. Right. Yeah, museums are exciting. You want to take all your kids? Oh, for God's sake, come on. Live bombs, yes. <laughs> The fact that they didn't disarm it is a little bit uncomfortable, actually. Wouldn't this be like a, you know, a global news report if a bomb wasn't was actually armed in a museum? <sighs> right. Anyway, down we go. Let's detach this. Maybe this is America. Of course. There we go. Oh God damn it, Laura! Why did you drop down? I didn't actually press anything there. Oh wow, the rat actually has more endurance than the human beings in this game. That's in that's interesting. Anyway, uh, was there anything to do up here at all? So far, I haven't seen any like hidden walls or anything. I don't know about you guys, like, but uh, it doesn't look like there has been at all. Uh, do you not like museums, Sydney? <laughs> I find them a bit boring myself. I'd rather just look at a bunch of pictures online. I have no respect, clearly. I've never been to one. What country did you say you were in again, Ta uh, Takiraiza? Do they not have museums in your country, or uh, is it just that you've never been one? Oh yeah, pictures. Those kind of pictures, of course, Fracture. <laughs> you wouldn't download an artifact. Okay, is there... Oh, there's something over here. Are there furry museums? There will be by 2050, I can guarantee that. Um, uh, life will be so much less bearable. Right, what's that? Okay, door down there, brilliant. Okay. Let's go down. Oh, your death count's not looking too good today, guys, I'm afraid. Pakistan. There are museums there, a few, but they're all really far away. No, fair enough. Right, okay, so uh, down we go. Sorry, I couldn't remember where you were from. It's been a long time since I asked you, because I do remember you told me during um, the last revelation, I think, or something like that. Uh, because um, it had something to do with you speaking... Uh, it may have been Arabic, I, I can't remember. Oh, God, yeah, the rats are more durable than the people. 
Oh, there we go. We got the fire exit key. Now we got to remember where the fire exit was. I don't remember. Do you? Was it really that cramped then? That's another thing. I'm not... I don't handle being in public places too well, especially if they're very cramped and stuff like that, so, uh... Yeah. Not my kind of deal, really. Yep, the Arabic posters. There we go. Of course. See, my memory is pretty good. Sometimes. <laughs> it wasn't that long ago, though, really, to be honest, when I did uh, The Last Revelation, because I remember I was, um... Either starting or finishing it just before set a fire and follow the rats. Yeah, that, that's a good idea. Um, I think I was uh, either starting or finishing it towards the very first time I did Extra Life, actually, in 2016. I think that might be Chronicles I was starting. I just finished The Last Revelation. I can't remember. It was a long time ago, though, yeah. Dawn of the Dead. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not too big on camping either. I don't mind if I have the facilities and whatnot, but honestly, I don't like public facilities overall either, like showers and stuff like that. You know. Okay, so uh, was the fire exit in this room, or is it not? I can't remember. It may have been in another area, or it might have been up here. We'll check up here first, and then we'll um, we'll head into that door and go the other way. I mean, if I'm running around in circles going the wrong way, you guys feel free to yell at me if your memory's sharp than mine is. I don't think it's up here at all. I don't think it is. I think it's through the door. I want to be thorough, though. My SO? What's SO? Excuse my ignorance. I'm quite injured at the moment, aren't I? No, I don't think the fire door is up here at all. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. No, we're going down. Yeah, this is the way that we got the, um, the airplanes bomb down, didn't we? Okay, can I drop here? Significant other. Right, got it. Thank you. Yeah, we can drop there. So where was the door? It was on the left. Over this way, wasn't it? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so um, it's on the third floor, the fire exit, isn't it? Uh, am I right to think that? Maybe over to the right-hand side? Uh, it's been a while. Call him a relic. Well, that's fair enough. <laughs> oh, Laura. Disappointing. I was just going to grab onto that then. Right, up we go. Camping is fun, but not when building the tent. Uh, yeah, oh god. So many memories from when I was a kid. There we go, I found it. Okay. What? That's the fi- Real- Okay. This museum's got problems. I don't think it passed health and safety at all. <laughs> now, the museum's burning down, children. If you want to live, you better climb this fast. Right. Okay, she's climbing up. There's a mobile at the top. Is it? Is it a Samsung or a Nokia or what? Come on. Oh, it's a radio. Leader to team. Helicopter leaves in five minutes. Your team's dead. We murdered them. We massacred them all. Five minutes? I have to stop them. Oh, please don't give me a timer. Look at her run away with a blurry grey. Oh god, we actually have five minutes. Okay. A jump! Oh god, probably shouldn't have jumped like that, actually. Give your dog grub! Um, doesn't sound very pleasant, really. Oh god, okay. W where am I climbing here? The depth on this isn't working too well, admittedly. Um, what? Hello, FFMeo! Welcome! Oh no, this level! I've- I've- I- I- oh! Shit. I should really pay attention to where I'm going. I'm gonna do that. For a big welcome to yourself. I know, actual music! What's going on? Vaz! Buy it! I shall. Oh, there we go. I made it that time. Let's pick this up. Okay, so we gotta go across the zip line. Still can't beat this level today. Oh god. Okay, so it is really hard. Nice underwear, by the way. Go on. Go! Jump! That's it. We can do it. 
Oh, god damn it. Yeah, she's been drinking very heavily. Oh, fuck. I need to kill this guy. Okay. Oh, what? What, what, what? Just... Oh, oh. I don't think that's how chimneys work, but okay. Uh, I just died immediately. Right, so, uh, d d the rooftops. I didn't get this before. Oh, for God's sake, I immediately just fall straight off the edge. Well, there's one for your death count, I suppose. Oh, God. Come on, up we go. I know, finally! I need to jump a little bit earlier for these if I'm gonna grab them. Yeah, I like this music, it's pretty cool. Alright, go on. Keep going, Laura. Jump. That's good enough. And again. Okay, so I've gotta be careful of these. Got it. Let's shoot this guy. Right, and go. Climb. Come on. I like to play Rise like she had an alcohol problem. So I always carried a bottle. Good good idea, good idea. Right. Upbeat Mario. That's implying that Mario isn't upbeat already. Oh fuck, I didn't see that. Break heal myself. Um right. This demands a running jump, I think. Okay, we're good. Oh, what the heck? Who's he? Oh, don't matter. Keep going. Why did he have one green leg? Oh shit, I didn't see those. Fuck. I need to pay more attention to them. Oh god, we're right back at the beginning, aren't we? Okay, that's fine. Try duck when... Uh... Oh right, okay. Yeah, they can't actually shoot you when you're ducking. I never knew that. Not that it really matters, we've got plenty of health kits at the moment, but hey. We just need to be as quickly as possible, really. As quickly as possible, oh god. Hello, Gilio, welcome back. The death count is gonna have a party. Hey guys, you're doubting me now. Right, go, go, go. Up we go. Uh, wait for this. Go! Perfect. Right. Okay. Go, go, go! Up we go. Right, wait for that. And go! Yes, you can roll, but, uh, it's not a whole load of use, really. Do you give your dog grub? I don't have a dog with which to feed Grub, unfortunately. Right. So, second area. What did I have to do here? Oh, shit, I forgot about that. Right. Okay, wait for that one. No, we're fine. Keep going. Green leg. Hello, green leg. Right, go, 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 go. Jump. That's it. Oh, that dog. Hmm. Oh, first aid kit. Lovely. Jump! Oh. Uh, forget about him. Oh, it doesn't matter, it's a bit late now. Oh god, he goes down fast. Uh, oh shit, okay, so I was supposed to slide down that. Oh god damn it. Getting all over the place. The area objective is to not die. Radio Apple, 109.7 FM. I didn't get to read the rest of it. That looked like Alan Partridge, though. I'm gonna grab that. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Uh, actually, no, I can go down here. Oh, crap. Didn't see that guy. Come on. That's it. Whoa! Oh, that was a bit rude. What the heck? Okay, I'm not even gonna question this. We're fine. Just keep going. This has many roots, seemingly. Oh, god, I better heal myself. Right, go, go, go. That's it, keep going. Oh, god, another guy. Fucking hell, I don't- I never get time to react to those. Vaz made my allergies flare up. 
Ah, I remember the Vaz Crisis from uh, 2003. Oh, I keep going up. I'll tell you what, let's go to the very top, actually. I think we might be safer up there. Alright, grab that. Get out of that man, please. Oh, God. Uh, I don't know if we can go up there, actually. Oh, shit, okay. Never mind, we can't go up here. We need to go down a floor instead. Uh, Laura, get to the very edge, please. Go on, down you go. Yeah, that's it. Oh, fuck, I keep running into them. Get the gun out. Right, go, go, go. No, put the guns away. Oh, I actually did that without interrupting my run. That's good. Right, get that. Keep going. No, don't, don't do that. Up you go. Go on. Right, now heal. Go, go, go. Jump. Yes, she was inside him. Okay. That's where Laura belongs. Alright, slide, jump! Oh, okay, we're alright. We're good. Oh, here he is again. Oh, wait, no. Drink to be cool. Drink fizzy to be cool. Okay. I love a good bit of fizzy, don't you guys? Alright, next area by the looks of it. Nice. We have 47 seconds left, though. Jesus. Uh, hello, Statue of Liberty. Oh, here we go, we did it! Uh, what? What the fuck is going on? Okay, this has turned into a, um, uh, what? Uh, uh, okay, this is interesting. Um, well, let's shoot him, I guess. I like his hair, by the way. Hello there, Barco please. welcome back. I have no idea what's going on at the moment. Uh, <laughs> just keep avoiding them, please. That's it. Uh, if he throws left, I go right. Oh, fuck, I just skipped something. We did it. Uh, I, I, I'm gonna guess everything just blew up. You have sealed your fate. You will become one of the, uh, become the children, the cho, the cho, okay. She'll become the chosen one. And off the helicopter she goes, or on the top of the building, or wherever she was, I'm not even sure. Ah! But she's okay. I don't know how, but... Chosen one? What did he mean? Later at the museum. Laura, I just realised we're, we're definitely not going to pass the next checkup. So, we're in New York, what? He said I was the chosen one. Is, is that where... I don't know where the Statue of Liberty is, actually. She looks a bit clueless. Oh no! Laura! You've been cursed! Those men must have been from the cult of the Dark Queen! Oh, ha, 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 okay. Oh god, hello. They believe whoever has been cut by the sword can be used as a vessel for the spirit of their queen. You must find their lair and defeat their leader, or... She looks a bit disappointed by this. Is this the plot of Tomb Raider 2013? Am I Himiko? Or what? You will die! You must find Pino Le Le Lamar? Oh no. He is an old shaman. Who lives in a in a in a desist what desist part of the subway somewhere under the old Bergen Street line? Okay. Uh, once again, looks very disappointed. Why does he live there? He was part of the movement dedicated to destroying the uh, the core. I don't know what that is either. He lives in hiding, but he will help you once he sees you are marked. Oh, it's disused. Okay. I'm gonna guess that, yeah, they didn't actually put a... Right, that makes sense. Go as quick as you can. They will be after you. Good luck. Yeah, she just looks pissed at all times, so... Excuse me, is that some cola? Can I... Oh, god damn it. Burger! Eat me. Hey, I did alright. I thought you guys said I would die a lot during that. I actually only died twice. I'm, I'm pretty impressed with myself, if that's the case. Yeah. I am a true Tomb Raider of the Game Boy. Uh, what are you guys saying? I missed a few messages. Staten Island, New York. Yeah, okay, so I was right about being in New York. I, I kind of, my, my mind just kind of skipped a beat of you, know what I mean. I mean, it should be obvious, but hey. Can I take the fire extinguisher? There's, there's an arrow clearly pointing at it. No, it's all just scenery. Let, let's try running over to the left-hand side. I don't... 
Uh, honestly, like, uh, my favorite thing about this game so far is the complexity of the levels, like the design of it. Everything seemed a bit samey in the previous game, and it would uh, it would amount to me getting lost because everything looked the same, if you get what I mean. But, uh, yeah. I get what you mean, Zen. It is very difficult, seemingly, like, uh, timing the jumps and stuff like that. I feel like playing the first game actually helped me a great deal there. Oh, for God's sake, I'm stuck. Like, if I wouldn't have, I think I would have had a lot of trouble with that, for sure. There we go. Can I go this way? Oh, I I'm disappointed at the lack of dynamite, by the way, guys. Okay, so this is a secret area. Aha! Or is it? Because there's a fuse here. Seems like a key item to me. We're talking about vegetarian food. That's making me hungry. Please don't do that. Does it go in here, maybe? No. Okay, let's go up instead. Uh, no, nothing here by the looks of it. I like the foreground background thing it's got going on as well. The previous game didn't... Oh, wow. Wow. She, yeah, she really cannot take full damage in this game at all, by comparison. What? No! I thought there was... Was there not a save point? Oh, what? I thought he would have saved! Or, oh, whatever, that's fine. <laughs> Next time I need to loot for a save point, like, immediately. Hello, Bonsai. Welcome back. Destroy your internet. Oh, God, I can't believe that. Ah, fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh, no, I can't go through here. I'm gonna die now. God damn it. Ugh. I'm gonna have so much trouble with this now, aren't I? Now that I managed it on my second attempt. Ah, oh, shit. It's a 8-bit frog. Hello there, Koso. Welcome. Big welcome to yourself. It's good to see you. How are you doing? Guys, I think you missed one on the death count, didn't you? Well, no one toot that one. There we go, Sea Bites on it. Oh god, I can't believe I've got to do this all over again. Oh, that's okay, don't worry about it. What, why are you not- oh, for god's sake, it's fine, just go. Oh no, I'm doing it again! Oh. Yeah, I'm genuinely going to have a lot of problems with this now. <laughs> I really am. I can just see this going horribly wrong. Like, me just dying a hundred times on this. Thank you so much for following, Koso. Really appreciate it. Wind, stop talking about vegetarian things. Pay attention. Okay, he's gone. Never mind. Goodbye. <laughs> The death count of party I deserve. How dare you? Over 1,300 deaths in Dark Souls 2. I thought that was supposed to be the easier of the games. Like, I think I only died like 30 times the amount that I played it. I didn't even complete it, but yeah. Right, now I need to remember to kill this guy. This is literally one of the only problems with this level. Is his positioning. How the fuck do I sub to you on Twitch? Um, you can't because I'm not a partner or anything like that, so don't don't worry about it. If uh if you're gonna uh do anything like that instead, um I recommend donating to the charity that I'm um you know representing at the moment. I mean basically everything I do COSO is non profit, so yeah, I don't have any affiliation or um partnership with Twitch or YouTube or anything like that. For God's sake, I'm losing all my health now. Oh, right. There we go. Go on, go up, go up. Ah, go on, that's it. Health kit. Right, maybe this time I won't fall off the roof. I might have an easier time with this. I don't know. Oh, God damn it. I say as I dive down all, all the way down here. The DJ's choice. That's what I said at the bottom of that message board. Hey, at least we got to learn something today. 
Oh god, Laura, what are you doing? Please, go up. Oh, fucking hell. Today is the tiredest I've been during this Extra Life weekend. Doesn't feel like the ideal kind of game to play when I'm really tired for the most part. Come on. There we go, thank you. Right, over you go. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Go, go, go. Right, next area. How much more is left? I can't remember. Like, I only narrowly made it last time, didn't I? Up we go. Okay, go. That's fine. Ah, shit. Maybe faster. Uh, thank you, Miss Aquamonkey. I really appreciate that. Uh, oh, shit. I'm okay, I'm okay. No, I died, Frog. I died on the next level, so I had to repeat this, unfortunately. Hey, I think I got here before with 50 seconds on the timer, so I think we're doing okay. I mean, we've got a whole minute more. Oh, fuck. How do I forget about these guys so much? Right, heal again. Jump. Keep going. That's it. Pick that up. I can do this. <laughs> do you believe in me? Right. Okay. Alright, now I need to jump at the bottom of this, don't I? And then grab. There we go, I did it. Guys, always remember to drink fizzy to be cool. Otherwise you're just not cool. Uh, what difficulty did you put? Oh, here we go. We're here already. God, I did really well with that. Oh, shit. No, don't. Now I've just got to be really careful. I want a Fanta. Come bring me a Fanta. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. Shit. Come on. Don't get blown up this time, please. We can see what that first frame did. Yeah, there we go. We I did fine there. Right, so she was just grabbing for him. And then he slices her. Oh, okay, there we go. Uh, just standard orange would be nice, yeah. Right, okay, so let's skip through all this. And then we need to find a save point so we don't have to repeat that a third time. But hey, it's not so bad. It's not that bad at all, actually. Is that actually Zip, or are you just taking the pit? What the hell? Did the cam just move there? I swear I just ran into it and it moved. It does, look there. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, we need to find a save point before, like, we get murdered a third time. Well, sorry, we have to repeat the level a third time. Uh, right, go over there, be careful. It's gotta be one round here sh somewhere, surely. What do those guys wield? They have, like, um, tomfers or something. Right, so that opens that. Where did I die before? I died from fall damage from going up and then coming back down again, didn't I? Uh, so I could go do that again, but I need to be really careful not to fall off the top. What are the games you'll be playing? Uh, well, Koso, uh, today, of course, I'm playing this. I'm playing the same game tomorrow. Oh, the can... Okay, never mind. I take back what I said before. The cans have actually gone back into the place. I was... Uh, they, they were originally. Yeah, I'm playing this today and tomorrow. And then uh, tomorrow... Uh, I mean, the day after. Sorry, my head's all over the place today. Uh, yeah, the day after, I'll be playing Tomb Raider 2 on a dance pad. Really looking forward to doing that. It's going to be absolute chaos. And then finally on Sunday, going to be playing Shadow of the Tomb Raider. Uh, that's the latest Tomb Raider game by Crystal Dynamics, following on from Tomb Raider 2013 and Rise of the Tomb Raider. Oh, God. How long is Extra Life on for? Just this week. Just this week, Frog. I know I did 10 days last year, but um, I thought that was a little bit too excessive, really, if you get me. So I was having so many nightmares by the end of it. Though, uh, we did do the uh, forest recently, didn't we? I needed that fuse, I think, actually, so it's good that I came through here. Yes, I am going through every single Tomb Raider game possible. I mean, I've been going at it for about seven years now, I think. We're getting there. <laughs> We're getting there. With the introduction of streaming, I've definitely been able to get through them a lot faster, but hey. 
Okay, let's go down. Where does Alistair come into anything? Is he unique to uh, Tomb Raider Legend? Because I thought he was also introduced maybe in the classic Tomb Raiders, but doesn't seem to be the... Oh no, what the fuck is this? Doesn't seem to be the case at... <gasps> okay, I'm alright. The... the... Oh, god. This is a bit more complex, isn't it? Four fuses missing, oh my god. Okay. I'm glad you guys are looking forward to it. I'm going to call this session pretty short tonight, because, like I said, I'm feeling a bit tired. I think it would be best I rest it up and then... Oh, look at that. It's a bit smart, aren't they, in this game? Not as stupid as the ones in the previous game, where they just kind of, like, stood in a spot and waited for you to come down. Or, like, kind of wandered off in the opposite direction. They do actually try and follow you around. Oh, wow. Yeah, they do. He's camping. <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Please, get away from me so I can shoot you. Fuck. Oh, wow. Okay, I think I need to kind of make a bit more distance between us. There we go, I got him. Hi, he was introduced in the movies, right. Yes, I do remember that now. Uh, save point, finally. Thank fuck for that. Wait a second, what am I being damaged by? Oh, I'm gonna guess these are injuring me as I'm running through them. General Subway Litter, of course. That That's gonna do a lot of damage to you, isn't it? This game is reminding me of Gunpoint, but uh, way, way, way more janky and the music is giving me a headache. <laughs> Honestly, uh, this is the second game on the two, on the Game Boy, the second Tomb Raider game. Uh, I think they're, they're really good as far as uh, Game Boy standards go. Really, really good. Mechanics are really decent overall, but I don't know what Gunpoint is, so I, I can't really draw any kind of comparison. Is it a is it like a 16-bit, 8-bit game, or is it something... Wait, did that just retract? It just kicked me off there. Maybe that was timed. Okay. Oh, look at that! That's some really nice animation there. The train going past. Oh god, am I gonna get hit by a train? Okay, let's go through. <laughs> oh no, we're actually going on a bloody track. Yes, I remember you can walk backwards when shooting. I, I honestly, like... It's really awkward to pull off a lot of the time. Yeah, giant spikes, rusted metal, of course. Ah! Okay, yep, this, uh, this is dangerous too. Everything's dangerous. Okay, let's get on top of here. Do, is he inside there? Can we get inside there? Can we go through? No, we can't. Okay. Yes, Tomb Raider 3 flashbacks, definitely. Okay, so I can go down there. I can drop into the train and sort him out. I don't know if I want to do that, though. There is an item up here, well hidden behind this smash watermelon. I don't even know what it is. Uh, we can go up. Gunpoint is a more recent game. Well, of course, that's going to be a lot better. I mean, the thing is, is when uh, games... I, I realized recently, right, a lot of games that try to be loyal to... Um, oh, fucking hell. When they try to be loyal to being, uh, like, sort of 8-bit, 16-bit games, they don't actually truly do it. But that's understandable. Absolutely understandable, because if they did try and do it, the sound would be a lot more janky for a start. It wouldn't, like... Uh, work as fluidly. It would be cutting out and stuff like that. And, um, yeah. That's fine. That's fine. I understand why they would not want that in their game, obviously. Okay, so we're, uh... We're actually level with this guy. Let's kill him. There we go. 79... 70... Uh, sorry. 97 positive rating on Steam. Nice. I'll have to check it out then. If you want to link it me on Discord, that's cool. Okay, so another fuse in here. I refuse to believe the amount of fuses I'm encountering at the moment. Uh, okay, so no point in coming up here by the looks of it. I don't know why there was a rock that dropped on top of the train as well. Could have been to scare us a bit. We can climb up here as well. What the heck? Okay, never mind. Let's just go over this way. Uh, but yeah, this was made in uh, 2000. Um, one, I think, 2000. It's pretty good as far as Game Boy games go in terms of platformers anyway, because uh, Game Boy was not known for many good platformers, for sure. Uh, right, so we shot this before, didn't we? It's not the London Underground. I forgot what it was, but yeah, somewhere in America. The Underground in America? Anyone familiar with that? I hope so. Yeah, I heard that Rayman Advance was actually... Uh, we were talking about this. I uh, don't know if you were there, Frog. Uh, someone did say that Rayman Advance was actually really decent in terms of uh, platforming. 
Maybe I'll give it a go at some point. I was looking forward to maybe playing the, um... It was you, okay. Sorry. <laughs> I was the one. I can't remember. Uh, yeah, maybe we'll check that out. I was interested in playing the, um, Metal Gear Solid Game Boy game, as I mentioned. Go backwards. Actually, that does work a lot better than I thought it would, Mac. Thanks. Shanty, yeah, I, um, I would like to play those at some point, but I don't know if you guys would be that interested in that. Don't know how many of you have actually heard of Shanty before. I've only played one of the games before. I can't even remember which one it was. Uh, oh, enemy down here. Oh my god. <laughs> From what I remember, there's no train jump scare deaths. Oh, I'm so disappointed. Well, these trains seem all completely inactive. Let's uh, let's try and get to the other side so we can shoot him from a distance. Uh, uh, Laura, have you got your guns out? I can't see. Oh god, I'm about to get hit by this. Uh, yes, um, originally Shanty was a shameless Mario clone, but um, honestly, over time it became better than Mario, in my opinion. I, I like the platforming seems so much more refined than a lot of the Mario games, and a lot more fun, if you get what I mean. Uh... I could be wrong, but I mean, I haven't played many, many Mario games in recent years, admittedly. So, we found two fuses so far. We can't get up there. Yes, Shanty is the genie girl. You're right. Okay, up we go. I see a medkit down there as well. Save point. Oh, did I get hit by that? Don't forget, did, did I? Half genie. Yeah, that's right. There we go. Okay, let's keep going in here. Oh, there's no point. Okay, dead end. I made my skin tone really pale, or is that just the face makeup that I was wearing yesterday? God, I... It's really hard to get my webcam to work with me a lot of the time. It... Oh, fuck. Damn it. Okay, that's fine. Laura's taken plenty of blows to the head in her time. It's all good. I probably should heal myself, though, if I get hit a second time. Uh, no, Koso. Definitely not. The oh, fuck. Okay, we're alright. By the end of this week, I will have started Shadow of the Tomb Raider. I'll still have Tomb Raider Anniversary to do. I'll still have Tomb Raider Underworld, Lara Croft Go, this game, and then, um, finally the, um... What's the other one? Uh, well, I've got the Interactive Adventure. <laughs> but, um... I'm forgetting something. Oh, the um, the Tomb Raider Game Boy Advance game, yeah, the third one. Whoa, go, go, go! Okay, that's alright. The webcam is really fucking inconsistent. Oh, for God's sake, really? Core design. Why? There was a rat down here, I saw it walk away. Oh, God. There we go. Oh, yes, and as Max says, the classic expansions. That's Tomb Raider 1, 2, and 3 all came with expansions that were released like a year after they came out. My god. Why is this... Laurie, you're cursed. Oh god, she is cursed, actually, in this game. Okay. Uh, yeah, I was about to say, why are these all falling down from here just now? This place has been undisturbed for so many years and it's fine, but yeah. As soon as Laura ventures in there, everything's just... Falling. <laughs> Lost Artifacts is my favorite expansion. Well, I look forward to playing it. Oh god, we're quite far back, aren't we? This is a bit brutal, admittedly, this game in comparison to the previous one. I could see us uh, spending a lot longer on this one. Oh, fuck. So everything seems a lot more dangerous than before. Definitely. I would say that's kind of strange, Owl, because your English seems pretty damn good overall. Though I do recall, it might have been you or someone else who said um, my English is not very good when you first, like, said anything to me. And I was like, I mean, it seems fine to me. I know. Core design design. Best kind of design. Right, just gotta wait for that sound and then flip. Just be as quick as possible. Right, go, go, go. Ah, uh, there we go, did it. Um, I played Monaco, didn't enjoy it whatsoever. And um, as for Hotline Miami, that's actually on my list of uh, things to do. Uh, maybe more recent, actually. Uh, well, more recent than a lot of the games I have planned, because I think we could uh, maybe just give that a quick check out in one set. What? How does full damage work in this? I'm not even gonna question it anymore. Let's just keep going. I thought she would have died from that, but no. 
I didn't enjoy it. I played it with friends, and uh, yeah, we just found it a bit boring overall, really. It was okay, but yeah. Okay, so there was just a closed door on the other side of here. That was a bit pointless. Let's do a flip this time. Make life a bit easier. Yeah, that's another thing. Uh, Tomb Raider level editor levels. We're going to be playing a lot of those, hopefully, um, sometime in the near future. I don't I don't know what's going on, but... Um... Oh, for God's sake. Okay, all I was supposed to do there was fall down, not dive off like I did before. We can go through here. I don't think I'm going to do that just yet. Yeah, um, I would be looking to do some Tomb Raider level editor levels this year. Coming, sorry, in 2019. But yeah... Uh, deciding that Izzy Noodles is deciding, deciding on the first game I'll be playing, and then after that we'll probably do like a poll or something. Okay then, Win. Take care. Uh, damn it. Can't go up there. Can we maybe do a running jump? Wait, is that something flashing on the floor there? It isn't. Yeah, maybe we can do a running jump over to there. I'm not sure though. Oh, no, no. I like the little bits of litter, though, fluttering around and stuff like that. It's pretty cool. Since I am complete trash myself, you know, it delights me. <laughs> oh, yeah, they love shooting their, shoving their sticks into, um, lava. 2,763 Tomb Raider level editor levels. Let's do them all, shall we? No, let's not. That That's, uh, how many levels in each of those Tomb Raider level editor levels, though, huh? Because <laughs> some of them are actually multiple levels. They're not just one level. Yeah. 987 that are rated above 8. That sounds very generous. Right, so that opened something somewhere. I'm not even sure where that was, if I'm being honest. I'm getting a bit lost in this level, admittedly. It's probably going to be one of the tougher ones. I'm so sorry, kill me. Uh, you could say she was shoving it in a co- oh, oh, it hurts. Anyway, let's go down. Oh, okay, never mind. We're not going down. We're going to get rabies or something. Uh, anything else here at all? No. This area is completely shut off from anything else. That's strange. I have no idea what that is, Bonsai. Bird of Prey movie. Bird, bird, birds of Prey movie? I have two at the moment. Three. Okay, three. We only need one more, actually, so that's not so bad. We're doing alright. But then I need to remember where the bloody hell the fuse box is. At least by a dinner, yeah. Well, there's no point going down up here, is there? Do you guys recognize where the... where, like, what, whatever happened when I pulled the lever was? Oh, for God's sake. Oh, I think I've killed my... No, I haven't. I'm alright. I'll heal. Batman related. Okay. Uh, let's go up this way. Quest of Gold. 24 levels took me over 60 hours. Well, okay, there we go. That's what I'm going to do for the rest of my life, guys. The rest of my miserable life will just play uh, Tomb Raider level editor levels. <laughs> Black Mass fused to his face. Right, okay. I'll have to have a look into that, unless I've already seen it and it's just gone straight over my head. Uh, we could go over... Oh, it's over here, isn't it? Yeah, that's right. That's okay, don't worry. Dirty puns are welcome here. We do need to protect the kids, though. <laughs> now, everyone's over 18 here, right, guys? You did go through the check. Hello there, Daniel. Oh, what's this? Oh, Koso donated $15. Thank you very much. I'll try to tune in tomorrow. Oh, that'd be awesome. A huge thank you to yourself. Oh, yeah, we are so... Pa oh, God. Punishing me. Okay, have we been down here? I think we've been... Okay. We haven't been down here before. <sighs> Sorry, just panicking, because this looks exactly the same. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we are... Um, we're, we're definitely over the amount that we raised last year, so a huge thank you to everyone who has donated. You are awesome. So obviously this is... Oh my god, she's crawling up nothing at the moment. Uh, I'm not even going to question it. Yeah. Yeah, this is uh, all being raised for... Oh, for God's sake. Boston Children's Hospital. Doing this for the kids. And uh, at the moment, I think... Uh, 
as a whole, Team Tomb Raider is doing really, really well. We're actually getting very close to our goal of $5,000. I think uh, we have just gone over 3000 which is definitely a high point for the, uh, the stage that we're at at the moment. We haven't even gone into the main weekend, so a lot of us haven't even started streaming and stuff yet, if you get what I mean. Must shield the children. Yes. This is for the children. Apart from the children can't watch it, because that would just be wrong. Oh, go. There we go. I'm gonna heal myself. Yeah, big welcome back to yourself, Daniel. How are you doing? Sorry, uh, a boulder rudely interrupted me. The team is at $3,177. Brilliant. Really good. I'm really glad. Like I said, a lot of us are going to be streaming this weekend, because, uh, well... You know, a lot of people are going to be busy during the week. It's not like it's a holiday week or anything like that, is it? So, around the world. Oh god, no! Okay, we're alright. So that's the last fuse, that's the last fuse. Brilliant. Have a good one. Uh, if you're heading out, Koso, take care of yourself. Thank you very much for dropping in. The stream that you want to be at for the record is the one on Saturday, because that's going to be absolutely hilarious. I'm probably going to die as well. It'll probably be my last stream ever, so yeah. Because uh, Tomb Raider 2 is notoriously one of the hardest games ever, for the most part. And uh, yeah, I'm going to be trying to play it on a dance pad. Doesn't sound like a good idea, does it? Sounds like something only a madman would do, but hey. It's happening. Oh, for God's sake. You'll have to watch it on your phone. Yeah, you're at work, aren't you? So, <laughs> it's such a shame, but hey. You can tune in even just a little bit. Code Madman. <laughs> Oh, how's the progress going on that project? Does anyone know? I am very curious, actually. Now, like, the only thing we can do right now is not die. That would be nice. We can go uh, all the way through this without doing that. Dark Souls playing on a rock band drum. I I've, I've heard of, like, a lot of people doing Dark Souls on different things, including Dance Pad, actually. I know there was a girl who did that. It's not what gave me the idea for the record. I found out afterwards, but yeah, it looked hilarious. It really did. Uh, so where do we need to put the fuses? It was right back at the beginning of the <gasps> level. Oh, thank you. You reimbursed me there. How lovely of you. Yeah, I skipped that chain. I, I, I skipped that, um, that part of life. I never was a child, actually. Just want to get that out there, you know. I scream. I scream at nothing. I like to yell at objects, inanimate objects, you know, when they don't work and stuff, so yeah. Uh, where are we going? I saw a bunny play Bloodborne on dance mats. So frigging cute. A bunny? What do you mean? A bunny? Like... I I'm just imagining an actual rabbit on a dance pad trying to play Bloodborne now. I don't know what- I don't know much about Bloodborne, admittedly. But I'm gonna guess you mean someone in, like, a bunny Kigu or something like that? Kind of like how I, you know... Twitch plays Dark Souls. No. Thank you. You like to scream for- I'm not gonna go there. Ha ha ha! Oh, no, it's this room. Shit, I've gone into the wrong one. Where was the exit, then? Yeah, scream for ice cream, clearly. That exists. Hmm. Uh, should I be going down here? Yeah, I think I want to go over to the left, don't I, to get to the, back to the door I was uh, started off on? Yes, yeah. Are we allowed to link Tomb Raider level editors' uh, levels? Uh, you, you can put them in the recommendation section if you want, Frog. And then uh, I will, like I said, um, include them as part of, uh, you know, like, the, the vote that I will do eventually. But what I would recommend, Frog, is not bothering just yet. If you get me, because, like, let me do the first level first, and I will ask for recommendations, and then post it. I think that would be best. What's the recommendation section? Uh, have a look on Discord. Have a look on Discord. I'm gonna guess you didn't notice it before. Oh god, have I not been here? There is a recommendation section, though. Uh, no, I have been here. I remember this area. Huh. What the heck? Why- why is everything reset? Yeah, suggestions. That's what it's called. Oh, where am I going then? Because I clearly opened that door in order to get, you know, 
Right, hang on a second. Let me have a look down first before falling down here. I don't want to get myself killed. No, I don't think that's safe at all, is it? Okay, uh... Actually, I do need to go off there, but I think this area down here is actually lowered a bit, so yeah, there we go. Where am I going now, then? Well, nowhere to go but down. Okay, so, uh, back to the train. I keep going this way. Yeah, I think it's in, like, the... Oh, you found it. Good. Okay. Yeah, here we go. Yes, this is the first area. This is definitely the first area because I recognize the color palette and everything. This is what I mean. This uh, game is a lot better for this, in my opinion. Everything doesn't look the bloody same. It's good. It's far better design, definitely. Uh, so where was the fuse box? If I run past it, yell at me, guys. But I, it comes up with a big A prompt, doesn't it? Is it a core design? Oh, oh! I enjoyed that one. Oh, it's here, it's here. Oh, God. <laughs> right, put those fuses in, Laura. There we go, we're through. Progress, guys. I feel like I'm doing okay with this one so far, for the most part. Uh, wait a sec, aren't we just on the other side of somewhere we've been before? No? Ah! Oh. Okay. We're alright. Okay. This is better color design than some PC games. I agree, actually. The color design for this is far better than the previous game. It really is. It's very nicely done, very intricate. A lot of, uh, a lot going on, you know. I mean, they obviously only had a limited palette to work with, but they seem to have done a good job overall. I like it. I really do. I can't, like, praise these games enough. Core design, we're really, really good at doing uh, classic style games, definitely. I'm gonna guess they had the team who did, uh, like, the, you know, the 8-bit, 16-bit games back in the day as part of core design doing these. I don't know. The rats don't seem as bothered by me, do they? They're a bit big to be rats. I think they're actually possums, but hey. Possums aren't aggressive. God damn, what's going on over there? That train is just not ending, is it? There we go, finally. Uh, so we can go through here. Let's try that. Something just opened. Spikes down there, okay. Let's do a running jump. Go on. There we go. Oh, sorry, I missed your message about uh, rabbits on the dance pad. The owner was... Okay, so it was an actual rabbit. Okay, that's a bit odd. But the owner was... Right, okay, that's cute. Okay, so we can drop down here. Uh-oh. Oh, we found a... Um... Oh, mind you, did we find any... Yeah, we did. I just completely failed to acknowledge the fact that we actually got rapid bullets at some point. Hey. It's cool. Oh! There we go. Okay, so this area was actually pointless, seemingly. Just gotta go over to the, uh... right, and go back, I guess. Crow, named after the Brandon Lee film. Ah! Cool! I love the crow- oh, for God's sake. What? What? She took so much damage from that! How does this work? It just doesn't, does it? Um, yeah, uh, I love The Crow. One of my favorite films, if I'm being honest. It is really good. I uh, feel like it could have been a bit better in places, but overall, really good film. Really good film. I like the visual design and everything. And I feel like it inspired like films later down the line, you know. So, uh, where do we want it? We want to go down, don't we? I wonder how big this game is in comparison to the previous one. Right, do a flip over here. Nice, this was a secret. Yeah, Brandon Lee was really attractive. It's a shame he died during the making of that film. Oh, are you alright, Wind? What happened? How did you achieve that? Alright, let's go through. Coffee ice cream. Um, I do if it's good coffee ice cream. I'm not big a big fan of coffee, but then coffee ice cream, coffee chocolates as well. Yeah, really like the really like the taste, you know. Oh, it's the ladies' toilets. Doesn't look like it. Uh, I think it's seen better days, hasn't it? And and the men's. Look at the design of this though. This is really good. It's the amount of detail they've put into this. Never got past the later part of the subway. Hey, we're gonna do it together, don't you worry, FF Mio. Uh, 
Uh, right, let's... The men's is owned by Dan Anarchist. Yes! <laughs> it is. Right, let's uh, head over here and get down this side. Hey, Laura, I wasn't running. I wasn't even pressing anything there. Cappuccino ice cream. Yep, it's all good. I'm not a big fan of cappuccino either, but cappuccino flavored things can be a lot nicer than cappuccino itself, in my opinion. Just one of those things where I like the flavor of something, but then don't, you know, like like it as a flavor, but then don't like the thing itself. A bit like prawn cocktail crisps. I know I'm vegetarian, so I ISO. Okay, interesting. This would have been Apple fans down here. Um, yeah, uh, I know that... Um, Oh god. I know that I'm vegetarian, but when I did have prawns years and years back, I could not stand them. I thought they were vile. So that opened that door all the way up there. Should we head back there now? Sid Vicious is in the men's bathroom, it would seem. <laughs> Indeed. Uh, what's this? A dollar? <laughs> what? We um we found a dollar. We found a singular dollar because of course Laura, Laura, a millionaire, forgot to bring any cash with her to America, so she's now currently picking up just dollars, dollar bills off the floor. Oh God, you guys, stop, stop being so ill. I hope you all feel better soon. Yeah, she got a penny. That makes more sense, Kelladen, actually, because it was a classic penny. Um, if you didn't really catch on to that, Keladen, basically, oh, for God's sake, the currency, oh, okay, we can buy a ticket here. Three dollars, okay. Um, yeah, the, the, the concept of that, basically, was it was an old British penny, one that's gone out of circulation, if that makes sense. Yeah, so, um, that was the deal with that, and that's why it made more sense, if you get what I mean. But here, she is actually just collecting three American dollars, which apparently she doesn't have on her at all. I mean, she might not have any change or something like that, you never know. Three dollars extortionate. I f I'm gonna guess I killed him. Alright, let's keep going. I'm gonna have to pay good attention to these dollars, they're not very obvious if I'm being honest. Like, I'm having trouble- I had trouble seeing that one that was on the floor. It looked like a claw or something. That's at least what I thought it was. There's another. And there's something else flashing here, actually. What's that? A small med kit. Okay. Let's keep going. A chicken pox at 16? Really? Oh my god. I got it at like four, five, like kids mostly do, you know. It's like our mother's infecting us. No, you're wrong, triple six. Three dollars is like 50 quid. <laughs> I'm joking. At least since Brexit, as we spoke about earlier. <laughs> right, up we go. Okay, so this is our final dollar. We got them all. Good. So let's save the game and then head back down again. It was all the way at the bottom, wasn't it? We need to get our ticket. Yeah, Wynn was a very ill kid, teenager, for the most part, from what I can tell. At least whereas mom, the stories his mum has told me. But I was pretty much the same, like, I was always ill when I was a kid, and obviously you know that I've been ill a lot recently as well, in recent years, so I've never been able to escape that. What, what did we get the ticket for? I'm not entirely sure. Like, uh, okay. Drive it. Live it. Oh, that sounds so generic. You've, you've hit the nail on the head there, core design, clearly. Hello again, Ray. Welcome back. How are you doing? I, I don't know where, where I'm going to take this ticket. I really have no idea. Did you guys see anything? Oh god, I've gone back to where the rat is. Like, anywhere we could perhaps put it, because I most certainly have not myself. Let's, uh... The stream, yes. The stream. I, 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 can we trademark that, please? We're the only the stream on the internet, I'm afraid. Anyone else? I'm gonna. Anyone else uses that name? I'm gonna sue them. 
That's good. I'm glad you're alright. I'm very tired myself today. Honestly, I haven't been sleeping so well during this uh, week of streaming. I keep on, like, jumping awake in a cold sweat because I feel like I've done something wrong on OBS, set up the stream wrong. <laughs> something like that. I keep on having nightmares about it. It used to happen all the time, but it stopped, and now it's happening again. Uh, okay, maybe, yeah, here we go. So we put that there, we can go through. This is an interesting barrier here. Yeah, they are very mundane, they really are, but I do jump awake in a cold sweat, I'm not even joking. Eaten by cows, that, that sounds interesting. Froggy! Yes. There once was a feline called Biggs the Cat. He'd best be described as large and fat. I have a phobia of cows. Okay, fair enough. Oh shit, I better get away from here before he starts knocking us in. Uh, I know everything will be alright, like, and you're bound to make errors during streaming, but hey! I'm gonna- I'm gonna wake up in cold sweats anyway, I don't care. <laughs> like, oh no, the bitrate's wrong! Oh, the frame rate! Everything's broken. Yeah, I think I've got to go down there, haven't I? Doesn't feel like Tomb Raider on being uh, underground slums in modern city. Uh, you'd be surprised, actually. A lot of uh, Tomb Raider 3 is actually set in an underground um, train station. So, uh, one of the areas, anyway. And um, let me think. Uh, one is set in London. One is set... Um, I can't think of any others. I, I mean, like, Tomb Raider's been everywhere. Tomb Raider really has been everywhere. Tom Raider. Uh, let's go in here. I, okay, it looks like I could slide down here. I've got to be really careful, though. This is uh, set in New York, for the record, Ray. Seemingly. At least we... Oh, God, what the heck is that? Danger, live Ray. That, that, that's very live, yeah. Um, running down my electricity bill right there. Uh, what? Oh, okay, we've got to go over the top. That makes sense. Yeah, Laura kills the local police force in London. That's that's my favourite game. It actually happens as well, that's a sad thing. It does remind me of old 90s Prince of Persia. Now, it's funny you should say that, actually, because uh, originally Tomb Raider was based on Prince of Persia. It was trying to take it into a kind of 3D form, away from the traditional roots of um, Prince of Persia, though Prince of Persia had done a 3D game before Tomb Raider was a thing. But... It was a complete and utter flop, from what I recall. It was terrible. Hello there, Jason! Welcome back! It's good to see you again! Oh shit, I think... Okay, we're safe. Good. And uh, we can save down here. How are you doing after yesterday? Have you recovered from the uh, trauma of playing Friday the 13th with us all? <laughs> my throat's a bit sore. I need to drown myself in honey so I can keep streaming these next few days. Uh, right. What's that? Go up, wind, you fuck. What? Oh, the track. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, there we go. There's another death. Where are we now, then? We've gone a little bit back, but not too far back, have we? The house sorted yet. I spent all last night cleaning. I'm not even kidding. Like, and it's still not all done. Wait, what's this? Oh, we can turn that off? Wait a second, where did we go before, then? Hmm. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Thanks for joining us yesterday, Jason. Can't say how much I appreciate it. It was, it was a lot of fun, like I said. You know, we had a lot of fun with that. Uh, did I come down here and then go to the left, maybe? I think that seems about right, doesn't it? Or, oh god, I don't know. I actually don't know, I'm lost. Guys, if you want to guide me a bit to tell me where I went before, then feel free to let me know, because I, I feel a bit lost now after I've died. How many deaths are we on now? Seven. Oh, I don't know if you noticed, guys, but I actually got, like, an original Tomb Raider font for the death count, which is, which is just sat below me here. Um, I can't remember the name of the user who made it, but uh, they did a really good job with it, in my opinion. You need holy guidance. Okay, I will pray. Pray for guidance. In the chat. <laughs> yeah, we went this way, didn't we? Right, so climb up there. Actually, am I going backwards? I might be going backwards through the level, so please stop me if I am going backwards through the level. 
Yeah, it's very Tomb Raider 3 style, I agree. Very Tomb Raider 3 style. Yeah, this is back through the level. God damn it. Okay, let's go the other way. Wait, this TV up here is powered. God, it really is running up the electricity bill. Oh, God. <laughs> it really is running up the electricity bill. It's Eldwich. Yeah. Well, it's not Eldwich. It's, uh, it's a station in New York. I don't know, it might be based off a real station, you never know. Uh, it certainly looks very American, what with the toilet design and everything. They've done a decent job, in my opinion, at least from what I've seen of American movies and video games, like The Warriors and Resident Evil Outbreak and stuff like that, you know, the ones that you see subways in. Yeah, it definitely looks like an abandoned American subway, from what I can tell. Hello there, Robert the Bruce. What a way to start uh, my week off by watching Lonnie's stream Tomb Raider. Never actually heard of this one, though. A big welcome to yourself. I don't think I've seen you before. Uh, yeah, this is uh, the second game on the Game Boy Color. I I'm enjoying it a lot. It really is a lot of fun. We just r finished the uh, first Tomb Raider game at the beginning of this week, so yeah. <laughs> Hope you enjoy watching. Let's try going up here, then. I don't know if we came up here before, though. I'm getting very lost, admittedly. Oh, flip. There we go. You go in. We all right? Oh, there we go. No, climb up, Laura. Please don't do that. Okay, so there's a lift here. I'm getting very lost, admittedly. Lift not working. Okay. Hmm. Just drop down. There we go. Von Croy Industries in New York. Uh, oh, right, so is that where you are in um, RC6 or whatever the fuck it's called? The uh, VVV whatever, oh, I don't know. The one that's in Chronicles, if you get what I mean. The, le the level that's at the end of the Chronicles uh, video game. Is that where you are in uh, that, in New York? VCI, that's it, yeah. I don't know where... Right, so we can go up a lift here. Kind of banish that from my memories, if I'm being honest. Von Croy Industries, yes. This lift isn't working either. We need to apparently get electricity back to this place, but the set. Why is that rock there? Can we not shoot it down? What? What was the point in that? Has it got something inside? Okay, that was a bit strange. Where did I die before then? Stop! No! I don't wanna... Oh, never mind. Okay, I'm a bit lost, admittedly. I can't figure out where to go from here. That level made me scared of lifts. I'm not surprised. Turn on the power again. Wait, what? Did I... did I turn it off? Oh, right, yes, okay, uh, got you. Where, where, where do you turn it on then? Oh, here. Right, so I did this before, I get it. No, I didn't. Oh, I'm very confused. What, what just happened? There was a series of explosions through here. Has it blown out this door, maybe? No, it hasn't. Maybe that was the power turning back on? Fuck if I know. <laughs> Let's just go up and see if we can actually get in the lift. I uh, suffer from pr sleep paralysis sometimes. It's not a lot of fun. The last time I did, I suffered from it twice in one night, which is an achievement. Uh, so we go down, okay. Oh, shit. Uh, we may as well just go, actually. Uh, just watch this guy casually follow us over here. Alright? Oh, 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 another guy. Back away. There we go, we got him. What is going on here? Power generator? Uh, need generator key to shut down. Okay. So I'm looking for a generator key. I did not see that gap. I actually did not see that gap. It's not very clear. I think they screwed up the pellet a little bit here. Right. So we can go up. We can go to the right. There's a whole bunch of places we can go by the looks of it, actually. Uh, let's go up this way first. We'll check out the upper areas. Uh, wow, there's a lot of these guys here. They're just chill. In an abandoned subway station, sure. Uh, it doesn't seem like there's any of these secret walls in this game that they had in the previous game. 
which I'm not complaining about because um, honestly, like I don't think they were uh, a great feature overall. Especially given like the end of the game, the issues that we had with the um, hidden walls being really hard to notice in the water segments up until a point. Yeah, sleep paralysis can be a bit scary. Uh, I haven't had it too much myself, but yeah. It is basically where your body is isolated, but you're wide awake for the most part, and you just cannot move at all. It's not very pleasant. It makes me sweat like crazy. Oh, fuck. Am I alright? Okay, never mind. So, uh, can operate 11, nothing happens. Okay, let's get out of the way of this. Oh, there's a store down here, guys. What do you want? Does anyone want some, uh, Fanta? Still. Uh, another lever here. I'm gonna guess you can't operate this either. Nope. Okay. Let's try going in here, then. Uh, can we break these? Can we go up here? Nope. Yeah, that that's fairly normal, Sydney, Sydney, for the most part. I wake up in cold sweats all the time and, like, crying for a reason I don't even know sometimes, or I used to anyway. I don't actually cry anymore at all. After I took a certain medication, I lost the ability to cry. I don't have a clue why, but I heard it's quite normal for the medication I did take. Which is actually pretty unusual, I can kind of admit, not being able to cry. It's very... I don't know, it makes you feel less human, I suppose. So we've been collecting a whole load of old valves for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why, but... Uh, let's keep going, maybe we'll discover why. Should we go down this way? I only cry at sad anime, yeah. Don't we all? I only cry when Kate Marsh... Ah, here we go, this is probably what all the valves are for. Right, so is that all of them? No, do we need more? Uh... Okay. We used two of them. Or three of them. I'm not sure. But that's powered something. We can actually see where the, um... Oh, here we go. Okay. So maybe we can pull this now? Yeah, here we go. It opens this door down here. Okay. Oh, sorry to hear that, Miss Aquaman Monkey. Right, another area. Hmm. Shed manly tears when watching anime. Oh god. Uh, so I need to look over this edge because I can't really see what's down there. I uh, don't think I want to gamble on that really, but if uh, there's if we can't see anything off this edge, then I think it's best we go down that edge on the basis that there is actually a way to get down, if you get me. So, uh, well... Starts with a waiter. Yeah, there we go. We're fine. Okay. Keep going, then. Flip over to this side. And it looks like there's a locked door here. Oh, water segment. I was wondering when one of these was going to make an appearance. So is the water mechanic still the same? Seems to be, actually. Yeah. Pretty decent. Oh, there's a train in the way. I didn't even notice. Actual acknowledgement of objects, that's amazing. Uh, go down this way to the left, maybe, inside the train. Yep, there's definitely something there. What's that, a small med kit? Okay. Uh, we can keep going. It's very quiet, isn't it? Okay, air pocket. And down again. Let's check up here. Yeah, there seems to be something up here. I don't know, this floodway has all kinds of elf hazards. Ah, oh, I was wondering when we are going to find something unnatural. What's this? Uh, what the fu- Uh, this seems very comical. What the fuck? We've gone from having skeletons to this guy. It looks like Otacon if he was zombified. Bloodborne enemy, oh no. A goblin, oh my- God, it's just getting really cartoony now. What the fuck? Sorry, I think my PS3 just turned itself on and off. It keeps doing that. Ah, there we go. Hello there, Delinator. 90s sitcom character in the episode when, uh, where paint gets dumped onto the father. Wait, what? Sorry? Am I missed something? 
Uh, da, 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 da. Wait, Delanator. Oh, is that you, Deltrude? I might be wrong. I can't remember if uh, you did, like, change your name or something like that. But a big welcome, regardless. Let's go over to the right. Corella Deville zombie. <laughs> Oh, Snoob! Hello! <laughs> Welcome back. Sorry. Well, I don't think you've actually uh, said anything before, actually. Maybe I'm wrong about that. Uh, sorry, I had a friend called Del, uh, Del Trude, who used to be on, uh, like, used to come to my uh, Twitch all the time, uh, you know, like, come over to my Twitch channel all the time, stuff like that. I'd even be a moderator at one point. Uh, but she had a kid, and since then she's not really been very active. I think we're best just climbing up here. Come on. Let's go. Oh god. This is ridiculous. I don't think these guys are meant to be killed. I think we're just best avoiding them. I like the way that if you run past them quickly enough, they don't actually do any damage to you. So much better than the previous game in that regard as well. So, uh, are we safe to go down here? Well, we're fine. If we lose any health, it's not a problem. Did I actually find anything in here? I'm not sure I did. Let's keep going. Uh, where are we now? What the heck is this? Can we do anything with this? Yes, we can. Zombie mutants. They're, they're, yeah, there must be mutants of some variety arise. Pump needs fuel. Wizard needs fu food badly. I was about to say fuel badly then. Right, let's go down. Uh, Cursed by the sword. Is that what Laura's going to become? Oh no. Then she'll just have to walk around New York slapping people while being green all the time and looking very nerdy as well. Ghoul enemies may look ridiculous, but they seem to be dealing a lot of damage in groups especially. Yes, <laughs> they are very dangerous, Robert. Uh, what the heck is this? Sonic? No, okay. Um, uh, God, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing. This is during the Clinton years, isn't it? Oh wait, no, of course it's not. 2001. Well, it depends where it's set, actually, because um, a lot of Laura games are set during the uh, like mid to late 90s, aren't they? So, but sure, if uh, I'm pretty sure, if he even if he wasn't the president still, he would try to kiss Laura. Oh, here's the oil. Didn't have to go far, did we? Okay. Oh God. Right, stand under it, and jump. You know, I can't actually see uh, what time we're on in regards to the stream and whatnot, so if you guys want to pull up a, um, a stream time for me, I'd appreciate that. What I will do for you guys is uh, we'll do a longer session tomorrow. Two hours and 60 minutes. Okay, I'll, we'll go for a bit longer. But yeah, I will do a longer session tomorrow to make up for this one being a bit shorter, providing I'm awake. You know, even if I'm not, I'll, I'll try my best. But yeah, like I said, I just didn't sleep particularly great last night, so yeah, it happens. But yeah, we're doing this again tomorrow, so... Hope to get this game finished a, a lot faster than we did the previous one. A whole year! A whole year! Yeah, see you next year, guys. No, I'm just kidding. Oh god, we need to get back up there, don't we? Oh, good old Bill. There we go. Did it. Up we go. Okay, so the fuel, where the fuel needs to go was just in here. Uh, this game, for the record, doesn't seem to be as misguided as the previous one. I'm having a lot more of an easier time actually finding my objectives, where I need to go and stuff like that. Has that gone over, like, to... where? where is that gone to? I say that now, like, I'm... I'm Oh, yeah, this room is completely full of water now. Aha! Right. Won't be around the second part of the stream due to a gig. I hope you enjoy yourself, Robert. Not a problem. Uh, I mean, if you, uh... If you want to catch up or anything like that, I do upload videos to YouTube, but, um... What I will probably do is do the second session tomorrow, and then... <gasps> the blessed dynamite! Sorry, Robert. It needs to be acknowledged. Um, yeah. Dynamite sticks. Oh my god. 
three. Amazing, yeah. Uh, we will do the second session tomorrow, and then the third session will probably come in a week's time or something like that. Just depends what I'm doing next week, and I'm uploading a few videos and stuff, but yeah. Uh, yeah, it'll go up on YouTube. It will go up on YouTube. I'll probably have it up by tomorrow. We still need to upload the video from yesterday because we had a few issues with uh, the stream yesterday, so I had to fix that, clean it up in the post-stream. But yeah, everyone's good now. Yes, she can blow up the world. Laura doesn't donate anything to Extra Life. I'm disappointed in you, Laura. You could have given those three dollars to Extra Life. <laughs> uh, right, so we can go through this door. I'm not sure if uh, we want to go down first or whatnot. We're back where we were before. Okay. What's new? We still have an old Velve. We have three dynamite sticks, and I have absolutely no idea where the fuck these are gonna go. Uh, was this door open before? I think it was, wasn't it? This is still not open. Maybe we should find where this leads to and actually reactivate it, I don't know. Uh, can we yet? Two Velves missing, okay, so we need, um... a further two Velves in order to get this working. Oh, whoa, 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 what? Uh, okay, that was special. I didn't do that. Okay, climb up here. Ah, yes, I remember the slidey bit. I miss Liu Kang's as well. Who are these guys? Right, so this is where the generator was. We never went over to the right, I think, so let's go that way. Uh, I don't seem to go anywhere, actually. Okay, let's run and jump over here. Aha! Okay, never mind. There is another old valve here. Uh, over to the left. Whoops! Oh, Lucangos. Lucambos, you mean? <laughs> Should we just keep going up for now? Uh oh, no, not like that, Laura. Can I do anything with this? Needs generator key, of course, to shut it down. Yeah. Yeah, you do need medkits, but I am still collecting a huge excess of them, for sure. But hey, they're a bit more necessary, aren't they? Oh, god damn it! It's best if we go to the top of that and then flip backwards, I think. That didn't work out very well. Oh. Well, never mind then. Uh, maybe do a small jump instead? That might work. I'm at the top of this. Right, let's try, yeah, do the small jump. Okay, that works. So what's over here then? We've been here before? I don't know if we have. Can we climb up these maybe? No. Okay, let's try drop dropping down here then, because I can't really see anything else we can ow. Okay, never mind, that was pointless. Boop. Come on. Get up. Uh is there anywhere further up we can go? I could just blow it up. I mean, yeah, we do have the dynamite. It would make sense, wouldn't it? But then at the same time, it would probably like, get us killed as well, based on the how short the fuse is on the dynamite. I swear I came up here right before and, like, uh, you know, there wasn't really much point in being up here. But hey, let's uh, do another check around. No, that this is a dead end entirely. Huh. You don't reckon we need a dyna the dynamite somewhere that's, like, really obvious and, you know, I'm just not really paying attention to it. 114 medkits, oh my god. Some of the Tomb Raider games, like, Core Design just did not know how to balance the difficulty in terms of, like, giving you health supplies and stuff like that. I feel like a lot of the Tomb Raiders would have been a better experience if, um... Core Design did know how to moderate med packs a little bit better. They do give you a huge excess of them. But the problem is, is a lot of the difficulty... Oh, for God's sake. A lot of the difficulty with Tomb Raider games doesn't seem to be to do with the, um... The fact you need med kits a lot of the time. It's more to do with, um... The fact the game will just fuck you over and kill you instantly. If you get me. Some of the time. Uh, okay. So we can't do anything here. Ah. What the heck is the dynamite for there? Oh, Jesus. Excuse me. 
I mean, I could put it down here, but I don't think that's such a good idea, really. It's not said anything about needing them here. I would have thought, given the prompts that we've been getting for everything else, that is something that you would need to do, really, if you get me, but... I don't know. We'll just go back to this area. I need just one more, um... Oh, two more valves, okay. No, 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 I need one more valve, don't I, on top of the one I already have. Okay, so let's go down here, then. Can flip over there. We'll just go through this all over again. Yeah, Crystal Dynamics games give you so much of everything, pretty much, you know. It did get a bit silly at times. Okay. Uh, yeah, the deck did force you to drop a long distance, didn't it? Ha, ah, I'm gonna have that to look forward to, but I'm sure you guys will help me out. I mean, um, no harm in you doing so, because obviously I played the game before, it's mostly just down to my memory, if you get me, so, uh, yeah. It's more down to the challenge of me actually doing it on a dance pad rather than me remembering what to do, if you get me. Maybe I need to go through here, though I think this is just back to the other room, isn't it? Whoops. Uh-oh. Uh... Pump? Needs fuel? I thought we already had fuel for this, though. Huh. More fuel? Where are we now? Gone through so many doors. This is a dead end. So there's another area where we need to apply fuel to a tank. Okay. Uh, that depends, Bonsai. That depends. I know I didn't do it with Tomb Raider 1, but... Uh, oh, we haven't been down here. Uh, yeah, I know I didn't do it with Tomb Raider 1, but the reason for that was I found the save system to be a bit frustrating, if you get what I mean, because obviously I'm going to die a lot. But the thing is, is like, uh, it was large gaps between each one. Now, you could argue that I could have got the PC version working, but it was a lot harder to get working with a dance pad than the uh, the emulated version, admittedly. So I went with the emulated version. Uh, my logic was, well, Tomb Raider 2 you can save anywhere in the PS1 version of, so let's go with that instead, if you get what I mean. More than just one part to do all of Tomb Raider 2 on a dance mat. I, I mean, yeah, maybe just a little bit. It has. What? What's that? Sorry, Matt? Backwards jump with... Oh, God. Yeah, Tomb Raider 2 does have the backwards jump with the mid-air roll and ledge grab, and I think it is necessary in one point of the game. Like, at the very end of it. Yeah, so uh, that's going to have to be something I'm going to try to do on a dance mat. Yeah, that's... Uh, that's going to be hell. But hey. Yeah, it's in the Temple of Xion. Yep. Xion. 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 Oh, I don't know. Can't remember my uh, Japanese... Uh, Japanese. <laughs> Chinese pronunciation. I can't even pronounce English things right uh, most of the time, so, yeah. I don't see anything that we can do here. <sighs> okay, so we'll go back to the first area. Maybe it's got something to do with that. Yeah, whole new speedrun achievement. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Depending on how much you guys uh, enjoyed the first session and whatnot, how much you, uh, you know, how much it raises and just how much you guys enjoy it overall, I might continue the playthrough, but I think it'll be a month-to-month -month thing. I don't want to focus too much on it, if you get what I mean. It's just gonna be one of those fun things that we do every so often. Based on how cracked this wall is, I'm gonna put a dynamite stick here. And it did nothing. Of course it did nothing. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, I, I better reload the save, I guess, if anything, because, um... Yeah, like, uh... The dynamite is used to destroy the door with the stop. Oh, I don't even remember that. Or something written on it. <sighs> I don't know. No idea. I'm very confused, if I'm being honest. Like, I have no idea what I'm doing. Let's just keep going up, though, for now. Tomb Raider 4 with the mic. Yeah. God. Through this door? Where did we come from? Oh, yeah, we came from that way, didn't we? God damn it. We need to go back down, then. 
drop down here. Have a drink. Hello there, Chris. -er. Chris, -er's. excuse me. Hello there, Chris. -er's. Welcome back. How are you doing? Uh... Oh god, the exploding Laura cheat. I don't think we're going to be able to do that on a dance pad. I mean, I could try, but I have to be very quick. Uh, this is now le. Oh, the water was drained out of here. Okay. It's been a good while since I actually came down here. So, uh, yeah, I think this is the right thing to do, isn't it? And there's a zombie just here. Die, comical zombie. No, don't slap me. Thank you. Surviving my awful internet seems okay for now, so I thought I'd drop in. Well, with this stream, you shouldn't have any issues whatsoever. You could probably drop it down to 240p and you would be, like, downloading, like, a, a, I don't know, like, a tiny, tiny amount of data based on the fact I have it so low for this game anyway. It doesn't re really need much bitrate, so... Yeah. Oh, shit, a fat one. Oh, God. I throw my hands in the air, in shock. Right, so I can slide down there. Maybe this is where I need to go next. Is he dead? I think he is. Uh, we can go up. All right, I'll save the game here. Uh, okay. Let's go... Oh, God. What? Oh, right. So that, uh, they make it very obvious. That's good. I'm glad about that because that would make... Um, it would make it a lot more difficult if we have to find it ourselves, you know, with given all the cracks there is in the scenery and stuff like that. Yes, I did, Chris's. I really, really enjoyed it overall. It was really good, considering, you know, the limitations and everything, and the fact that Core Design probably hadn't worked on a game like that in a long time, and this game is even better, actually, from what I can tell so far. So, what key is this? Train... Oh, okay, it's a train lever. Right. It's like... It's Amy Schumer looking for new material... Oh my god. <laughs> I, heard, I know about her stealing stuff, you know, like, joke comedy and stuff like that. I mean, I watched one of her shows and I was like, this sounds awfully familiar. And, yeah, it did turn out that it was just her repeating someone else's jokes. Can't remember what it was. It was a long time ago now, but yeah. Uh, where are we? Okay, so I think we just got to keep sliding down. I prefer this one. Ah, oh, fair enough. Yeah, it does seem a lot more refined, for sure, but yeah, I'll, I'll see when I, you know, get further into it, if I like it more or not. How long is this game, for the record? Like, is this one longer or shorter, would you say, or what? Anyone ever finished it, or not? Can we... There we go, I thought that's what we might have to do. Oh, I can shoot him, but he can't actually get... What the fuck? These guys are weaker than the other ones as well, actually, the bigger guys. I thought they'd be stronger. Because, of course, uh... Being fat makes you a lot stronger. That makes sense, doesn't it? <laughs> it's shorter. Okay, I'm. I'm. Ah, uh, that's good. I guess to some degree. All right. I can't say the uh, other one went on for too long or anything like that. Oh, I get it. I've got a slot. Oh, God damn it! Let me do that. Yes, I'm going to be streaming this again, Dark Porter. Tomorrow, we're going to be continuing on with this game. It was years ago, can't remember, fair enough. The last few levels of Chronicles on a Dan- No! No, I'm not even going to continue reading that. Don't deserve it. <laughs> you know how much I hate Chronicles. <laughs> Chronicles is still my least favourite Tomb Raider game in the entire series, for the record. Uh, yeah. I would say I do prefer, um... Angel of Darkness to it, definitely. Right, is that just for a large medkit? Is that it? Angel of Darkness on a dance pad would be even worse, actually, thinking about it, based on the fact the controls are bad enough as it is. At least Chronicles has solid controls, but very out-of-date controls for the year it was made. Game Boy, Pro uh, Game Boy Advance Prophecies. We will do that for Extra Life next year. Definitely. I'm looking forward to it. Up we go. Great torture method. Oh, yeah. What are we doing now, then? I guess we just got to do running jump over on the right hand side or something, because, uh... Oh, shit. 
well, we got to get out of here, but then what was the point in coming down here in the first place? Not even going to question it. Let's just keep moving over to the right-hand side instead. I should probably save again. Oh, no. Get down from there. Alright, yeah, and I'll uh, save here and then we'll keep going to the right-hand side. I think I'll make this my last level for now. I don't know how far away from the end of it we are, but yeah. It's been good so far. It really has. So I've enjoyed it. So I even enjoyed the running segment. That was actually a lot of fun, for the most part. You know, it utilized the controls beautifully, for the most part. Uh, something flashing here. What's that? Sh shotgun rounds. Oh. There's a shotgun in this game. Okay. Something that wasn't actually in the previous game. Right, let's get on top of these trains. Uh, we can go over to the right hand side. Nothing there. Hello there, Sison. A big welcome back to yourself. How are you doing? Thank you. I'm glad you like the hair. Uh, fortunately, it's only going to last for another day. It's gone tomorrow, so I uh, should be anyway. Uh, bleach it. So tomorrow I'm going to look ridiculous. And then I'm going to look even more ridiculous, actually, the following day, because we've got to dye our hair bright pink. Is, uh, that's what you guys requested. Uh, aha, uh -huh, what the fuck did I get? Oh, I got the train lever, didn't I? Okay, so what does that do? Do you guys remember where the fuck that went? I remember it being needed, but I don't remember where it, you need it. Uh, so yeah, any guidance you guys can give to put me on the right track quicker would be nice. A red alert is positively, like... Not a good level at all. I like pink. Yeah, apparently a lot of you guys like pink, because uh, it was a pulse I sent, so uh, yeah. The majority of people picked pink by quite a lot, actually. I think it was over 50% last time I checked. Chat handheld in disgraceful. I know. I should. Well, I tell you what, if anyone actually does give me a hint, I'll ban them immediately. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, is it here? This might be it, actually. No, this is the pump. Okay, fuck. Well... That's one thing down. Uh, over here? No, that was the edge of that area. Resident Evil Remake, honestly, unrealistic part is where Barry uses three magnum rounds in the first zombie and it still doesn't die. Yes, actually, I never considered that. Pink hair with red tips would be good. Uh, I think I'll just stick to standard pink for now, see how that comes out, see what you guys think. Yeah, it's gonna be silly. He's insane. Pink is quite a popular old colour in Japan's feudal era. Yes, it is, yeah. The colour of warriors, yeah. It's pretty cool. I do like pink. Pink is my favourite colour. You would think it would be blue, but it's not. Blue actually is not a colour I'm too fond of. I mean, how, like, how often do you see me wearing blue things, if you get what I mean? Like, uh, yeah. I own a lot of grey things, thinking about it, so it's kind of bluish greyish stuff, but then, yeah, not, not like bright blue or anything. I know, my fasona's blue. <laughs> yeah, and I have my hair blue a lot. I just think it's a colour that looks nice on me as opposed to, you know, a colour that I actually like. I just went back into the room I left. Okay. Oh no. I don't want people thinking I'm gay. When I'm so obviously not. Yeah, yeah, you might have noticed that my room's actually pink. Yeah. Have I been up here? I'm getting quite lost now, admittedly. Uh, this is the way to get up to the top. This is the area that, yeah, we want to go up here, don't we, in order to get back to where we were before, I think. I could be wrong. Oh, tired. Headache? No, this is not the right way. <laughs> Uh, 
It's over this way, isn't it? Yeah. All I remember is we need to go up in order to get to the door at the top, so this is the right way. Let's keep going. I feel like I've missed one of the, um, one of the, uh, what was it? The, the old valves, yeah. I hope that's not true, but... Insane in the brain, Sydney. Uh, we never went down here either, did we? I don't think that's a good idea, though. Gaze in my Christian post office, excuse me. This is my live stream. Please keep them out. Hey, uh... <laughs> I don't know if any of you guys have, uh, well, I imagine a few of you have watched my original Tomb Raider playthrough. I actually got a bit of backlash in terms of comments on that, uh, from making a joke about gay people. Yeah, that happened. Uh, oh, okay, I do actually have, okay. Cool. But yeah, you might, you might see why that's not really a problem. Uh, I guess they just thought I was really homophobic, uh, but yeah. It was only a very small joke as well. Oh god. Well, that's nice. Oh, Jesus. That scared me. I'm really looking forward to playing uh, Shadow of the Tomb Raider myself, actually. Uh, so I said, it's happening on Sunday. Oh god. No point in killing this guy, really. I mean, I could probably kill him from the bottom thinking about it. Oh god. She's getting confused. She's trying to shoot the guy below her at the same time. Um, I don't think that's gonna work, Laura. You can try. Uh, yes, um, what happened was, I think, uh, it was during one of the Grease levels. Was it Grease? Yeah, it is Grease, isn't it? And, um, I saw, like, a picture of two naked males, I think, like a drawing of two naked males, like, doing something to each other, and I think my response was just, oh, gay, or something like that. And, uh, yeah, some people thought I was genuinely being homophobic and hated the gays, but that's not true. You may figure out why, but, yeah. You never know. Could I mean, like, I have been called homophobic in person before, actually, by uh, two guys who were, oh shit, walking down a street in Manchester, and I looked at them a little bit, kind of like, unusually, if you get what I mean, and they immediately thought that I was looking at them because they were gay, but, you know. Uh, <laughs> right, looks like we can slide down here. I might have missed something back there, I don't know, though. Uh, why do I feel like we've gone all the way back to the very beginning of a level? Of the level, should I say? I'm pretty sure we have, actually. Maybe we need to do this. I never said people thought I looked gay. Where did you get that one from, Wind? Yeah, this is definitely back to the beginning of the level, isn't it? Wait a second, what? No, it isn't. Uh, oh, this is probably where the train level goes. Right. Mm, uh oh. Okay. Next stop. We're still in the subway. Uh, no, they were too busy yelling at me for me to actually say anything, really, so, yeah. Uh, it was a very short trip. We're about to have even a sh uh, an even shorter trip. Uh, oh, shit. Keep going, keep going. Oh, fuck. Uh, right, I need to roll under here, don't I? No, I can't do that. Shit, I'm losing health. I can't see what's going on. Where am I supposed to go here? I mean, I could climb onto the top of this, actually, couldn't I? That's probably best. Let's do that. I could hop over here as well. Go over to the right-hand side. Can't remember who it was. Uh, one of the commenters used to think that Pete was my boyfriend, so I just rolled with it. That, I, don't, I think they're long gone now, actually. I don't think they actually come to the streams anymore, but yeah. At first, they were flirting with me all the time, this being a female. And then next up, they thought Pete was my... Uh, they found... They found, they figured out that I was a gay, right? And then next step was they thought Pete was my boyfriend. <laughs> so yeah, I just rolled with it. Pete, Pete is my boyfriend, okay? 
I mean, we did do a Valentine's stream together uh, at the end of the day, so yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Let's kill this guy first. He was earlier, uh, Wind, I think. Does Jen know about you and Pete? Uh, no, she, she can never know about me and Pete. It's a secret. She's not here at the moment. She left earlier, didn't she? Oh, God. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm still all right. I use a full heal there. Lost loads of health. I think maybe I will uh, not try and attempt to jump that again. Well, it's more that uh, she was assuming that me and Pete were dating for some reason instead of just asking. So I just rolled with it. Hello there, PRTB Belmont. Welcome back again. How you doing? Oh, God, my knees. She's fine, don't worry. She doesn't need those knees. She, she can just afford another one on the NHS, so it's all right. Okay, up we go. Is there any point going up? I don't think there is, actually. Oh, God. Uh, go on, back away. That's it. Yeah, uh, a lot of um, things to do with the Greeks and the Romans in regards to, like, uh, you know, men being close together and stuff like that was to kind of encourage relationships between them, to make them care about each other and stuff like that, from what I know. I'm not sure if that is the case, but uh, I thought it was something down the line to that. <sighs> it's been a long time since I've done any history, admittedly. What's that? It shouldn't be what defines a channel as a whole. I know it sounds bad, but uh, people I used to watch were using their sexuality. Yeah, actually, I don't like it myself. I really don't like it. Um, uh, I don't know. Like, uh, the, I've, It's like if I change my name to gay plays or something. <laughs> you know, it, it's not all about the fact I'm gay. It's just, it's not important. It really isn't, and I don't get why it needs to be important. What it should be, actually, is vegetarian plays. There we go. Or nearly vegan plays instead. So, yeah, let's 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 change the name up. Because everyone needs to know I'm vegetarian. And you guys should be vegetarian, too. Definitely. Otherwise, you're unsafe trash. And you need to find God. Or, well, veggie God. Veggie Jesus. I don't know. <laughs> oh, whoa. What the fuck, core design? Oh, okay, never mind. Let's just go. Please, leave. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I think you guys. If you, if you see my, um, if you see my, um, life is strange playthrough. I actually used to know someone called, um, let uh, who had a channel called Let's Play Lesbian, and honestly, I wasn't too favorable of her name uh, choice. If you get what I mean, like I felt like. Uh, uh, just, you know, using so much definition of sexuality just doesn't... It's not a good idea, really. Uh, no, she is the same size, I think, but... Yeah. I, I mean, there's nothing wrong with it at the end of the day, but, yeah, I, I just don't find it... that attractive, personally, if you get me. I'm more about their personality in regards to, you know... Gay hairdresser, oh god. <laughs> Oh, oh, I'm being bitten by a rat while this is all going on, or a possum, or whatever it is, I have no idea. Alonso the Gamer, oh, could be a furry and a gay at the same time, amazing. Two lesbian players, yeah, yeah. Oh, there we go, wind. That could be our next venture, two gay plays. That's probably been used before, I don't know. Me and my gay boyfriend. Play a video game together. Urgh. Give me those views. <laughs> Two gay furries play. Two gay vegetarian furries. Oh my god! Wow. What else? Come on. Come on. We can. We can. We can up this game. Two furs, one stream. Smash that like button. Yeah. Like, comment, subscribe, guys. Oh, Jesus. 
I meant to do that. Definitely meant to do that. That was very elegant of me. It worked out, actually, so I can't complain. I was just checking if there's anything over here. Oh, uh, God, I hate the new um, Twitch stream tag system, if I'm being honest. Blood type. Hmm. No, it needs to be more minority things. I don't think I'm part of a minority in blood type. I could be wrong. I can't, I can't remember what my blood type is, but hey. Zombie Elvis. Ah, there we go. Figured out what he looks like. He looks like Elvis. Hello, Spleen. Welcome back. How are you doing today? Are you emotionally dead after yesterday's stream? I hope so. That's good. Oh, God. Fucking damn it. Okay, he's dead. Right. They're so comical. What What was that? This is the worst thing about this game so far is actually the design of these zombies. They're so comical. It just doesn't feel like it fits in with the rest of the game. It's like another team designed these or something, you know. It just it really doesn't fit in. At all. Dance mat. Two gay fur... Two, fr two gay vegetarian furries on a dance pad. Yeah. Just trying to think what, what else we're, we're part of. Persona of the Tomb Raider. Oh, God. We. Oh, God damn it. That didn't work out as well as I thought it would. There's nothing down here anyway. I mean, is there anything behind here? I'm glad you enjoyed it. I certainly enjoyed it a lot myself. It was one of the most fun streams I've done ever. Definitely. A lot of fun. Uh, so yeah, like I was saying before, the game isn't that good. It was more just that we made it fun for ourselves, really. Uh, can we get up here? No, no, we can't. Two furries on a budget, yeah. Well, Ellen's here at the moment, so uh, yeah. We were talking about that yesterday, I think, Alan. It was either yesterday or the day before, but you weren't around. I was trying to explain everything in regards to that. I think it was the day before. I can't remember, but yeah. Where haven't we been? Is there any areas that we've missed out on? I don't know if we have or not. Team Furry's on a budget. Yep. <laughs> oh, damn it. I don't know where to go here. Oddworld. Yes. God, I wish I could do a voice like, um, what's the main character of Oddworld called? Can we, uh, is there any point going down here? No. Is this the one you're playing on a dance mat? Yeah, Spleen, I'm sat down, my chair is on top of the dance mat, and I'm just rocking around on it with my butt, you know. No, no, that's, that's on Saturday, Spleen. It's, uh, Tomb Raider 2. Abe! Yes, it's Abe, of course it is. I mean, it's even in one of the titles of the game, Abe's Odyssey. And there's also Munch, isn't there, as well, so Munch's Odyssey. <laughs> Alright, have we got anything? Uh, okay, we can go over to the right-hand side. I don't know if we... we did that as well. Two gay furries play Tomb Raider 2 on a dance mat, uh, whilst, while doing satanic rituals. <laughs> oh, God. What if we find, like, uh, what if we, like, uh, become part of a religion as well? You know, like, we can we can fit into every minority. No, there's nothing down. What the fuck am I missing out on here? This was pointless. Was it? Oh, I'm confused. I'm so fucking confused. Okay. You corrupted him. Oh, no. You ruined him. Christ, what am I doing? I have absolutely no idea. Okay, I've not been here before. Good. Goofy zombie. Let's go this way. Get this. There we go. Shotgun rounds. I haven't even got a shotgun yet. Oh god, I'm nearly dead. Better heal myself. There we go. Political party. Oh my god, yes, this is perfect. So, um... Two gay Christian... No, not Christian. Let's pick something more... Mormon. Mormon. No, Jehovah's Witness. Two gay Jehovah's Witness, um... Conservative, uh, no, you, you, you kipper. <laughs> oh, I don't even know where I'm going with this. I've lost it. Vegetarian furries play Tomb Raider 2 
on a dance pad. Hello to anyone who's joining at the moment. You're probably very confused. Yeah, I, that, that's fine. That makes sense. Hello, the rapier man. <laughs> Welcome back. How are you doing? I, I I don't know. Don't question it. Okay. You don't seem very impressed. I'm sorry. Still alive. Ah, oh, oh, that's good news. Okay, this is a uh, CrossFit enthusiast. There we go. That that's what needs to be added in there. Perfect. But I'm starting. To, I, it's becoming a bit too much for me to remember. If I'm being honest. God. You're sexually confused. That, that's great news. Oh, I'm sorry for your sexuality, which is now ruined on my streams. Sorry. There's a helpline for that. Uh, just dial 1199 Alonzo Ryan, ruin my life. And, and repent, please. What am I doing here? Uh, I, I, I'm really, really lost. I mean, like, I, I, I feel like I should have found a key item down here, but I haven't at all. Oh fuck! Oh, uh, I'm okay. It would be busy all the, t all the time. Yes, I work at the call center. Yeah, Spleen can be on line one, definitely. God, my hair. What have I been doing to it? There we go. Work. Yeah, you're unpaid, aren't you? You're not allowed to tell anyone, though. Two furries, one goal. I flick elastic burns. Oh, good. What? No, I've just gone back into the door I was in before. Oh, God. Oh! Aren't you looking for the generator key, or have you found it? No, I still haven't found the bloody generator key. I'm so lost. Like, uh... Wait, can I fire the shotgun rounds out of the pistol? Please don't say that's true, Laura. Oh, what the... Oh, no, no, she got a shotgun out. That's really cool. Okay, never mind then. Not complaining. What the hell? How do rapid rounds work? Let's try using the shotgun, shall we? Wow. Dead. Uh, yeah, I've been up here many times, and there's still nothing here. I don't know why I'm up here again. I can't get any higher, can I? No, I can Right. Yeah, they turn your uh, pistol into a shotgun. It's amazing. Uh, where the fuck are we? Still the wrong place. Um, so many doors that we could go through. Okay, I'm gonna ask for a hint about where to go now because I'm I'm, I'm getting completely and utterly lost. If I'm being honest. I will keep looking, but, uh, yeah. I don't think I'm gonna get too far. Did I ever go down here? You know what, I'm gonna roll off here. No, I haven't been down here at all before. Ah! Oh! oh for God's sake, okay, the moment I asked for a bloody hint. Okay, never mind, forget it. So, I need to go back up, uh, using this route, I'm gonna guess. Are you gonna give this a go? Oh God. Yeah, not many people have played it before, seemingly, so... It's quite an unknown game. I'm enjoying it a lot, though, yeah. Alright, Miss Aquaman Monkey, hopefully see you tomorrow, or, uh, you know, in the near future. It was awesome having you with us once again. Alonzo, backseat gaming himself, I know. I, I give myself all the right solutions. Okay, so where the fuck does this uh, key need to go now? Oh god. Here! It needs to go here. Okay, so we're all the way back from where that train traveled to. Right. Where does the generator key need to go, though? Do you guys remember that? Uh, take care of yourself, Miss Aquamonkey. It's great seeing you again. I was around here somewhere, but where? She's got jiggle physics. Of course she's got jiggle physics. Why wouldn't she have jiggle physics? We need jiggle physics, guys. Uh, stores. It could be in here. It could well be in here, actually. Can't help, sadly. Yes, you can. Don't lie. 
No, it's not up here. <sighs> My memory's breaking. I can't remember where I go with this. Is it through one of the doors? Is it up here? I can't remember. I'm going to try going up first, and then we can try the doors, but I think it was in this area somewhere. Oh! Done. I need to see you suffer. I'm not doing a very good job of that at the moment, admittedly. What's that done, though? Uh, you know, I really don't know what that's done. So turn off the generator, which was doing what, exactly? I don't know what it was actually causing. Was it uh, maybe the water's drained from somewhere, or was there electricity causing us to not be able to progress somewhere, or something like that? I don't remember. It's been such a long time since we got on to the beginning of this level. Maybe I need to go up. Live rails? Shit, where were they? No, you're right. I think you're right about that, but then where the heck was that? That was so far back. It's not over this way. Oh, fuck. Am I okay? Yeah, fine. Well, let's keep going up for now. I mean, surely there must be a reason we have access to the top of here. That's just my thought, anyway, but then, no. No, there isn't. Okay, never mind, then. Fine, core design, be like that. Okay, it must be through one of the doors, then, because, uh, running out of options, really. Uh, over here, maybe? Actually? Nope. Nothing here, either. This was where we found one of the, um the levers or whatever it was, actually, so it's not here at all. Platform 2. Uh, platform... I think we need to go to Platform 1, perhaps? Oh my god. Ah, uh, fuck, I cannot remember. It's, it's really got nothing to do with this, has it? No. Hello again, Rep. Welcome back. Uh, do you know where to go? <laughs> Let's go to platform one first. And then uh, after that, if, if something's not really obvious, we'll just go over to the platform two. Oh, thank you. God, you're so knowledgeable. Have you played this game before? I think it is Platform 2, really, so forget Platform 1, let's just go to Platform 2 first. Because I, I honestly think that we, there was something we couldn't do in Platform 2 that maybe we can do now. At least if memory serves. Uh, no, Rapier Man, I'm afraid I don't. Platform 69? Oh. Ah! Uh, mm, I'm fine. Uh, huh. No? Oh no, we're stuck down here now. Okay. Can't say that's too good. He had a glowing box outside. Yeah. No, don't don't touch me. Comedy man. It's probably the weakest insult I've ever produced in my life. Can I get up there? I think I tried this before, didn't I? And I couldn't do it, but hey. No, I can't. Okay. Uh hmm. Uh The comedian. Hmm. No, no, not that guy. Slightly different. Roll! Oh no, we're back to Bill Clinton. I mean, of course we're back to Bill Clinton. We can't get away from him. This is his third term already. Uh... Right, we can go through here. That's right, don't worry. I'm joking. But, uh, I don't know if this is what we want to do, or if we want to go down, or... Oh. 
We're getting there a bit at a time, admittedly, but it is just taking a long, long time overall, isn't it? <sighs> I'm going through here. I like the way they designed this. Oh, yeah, I remember falling down here, actually. Uh, oh. Yeah, I remember this platforming segment. Let's try going up instead. Whoops. I say as I fall down. There we go. And up again. Roll through the vent. There we go. Yeah, I'm going for a, I'm going for quite a bit longer than I was hoping to, but hey. I want to get this level finished, because I don't want to be completely brain-fucked when I come back to it tomorrow. Hello again, Kale. Welcome back. Uh, I think... Could I do a running jump over to the other side of here? I think I could, couldn't I? But you have to be right on the edge. Yeah, there we go. Uh, okay, and up. Up and up and up. I, yes, I am, but, you know, I'll be even more so if I just leave this and go go away and then come back to it, if you get me. It must be somewhere over here. It really must be, but then, like, where? And go through this door? Uh, immediately, as soon as I start going through all these different doors, I start getting lost, admittedly. Are we back at the top now? I was expecting a lot more deaths, admittedly. Uh, the, the previous game is a lot more dangerous, so maybe that's why they uh, removed the uh, the amount of fall damage that you actually do not take. Well, increase the amount of fall damage you take in this game, because um, this doesn't seem anywhere near as dangerous for the most part. Like, uh, they seem to utilize the health bar a, a lot better. The enemies are a lot more dangerous, and the um, general hazards and the environments and stuff like that are also, but then, like, yeah, you don't die as quickly from sudden death, if you get what I mean. Okay, there we go. Well, one thing I don't want to do is get on that train again, do I? But then, where else can I go? <sighs> oh, God, I remember this level. Oh, uh, shit, I'm going all the way down to the bottom of that area, aren't I? I don't know how many levels I've completed yet, uh, Bonsai, but I'm going to take it as three. Oh, this is the third, sorry. I'm honestly a bit confused about how uh, short the levels have been or how kind of, you know, it doesn't give you an introduction screen or whatever. Well, if you guys want to start looking at maps, you're more than welcome to, because I, yeah, I'm getting very, very lost at this stage. I could be going the complete opposite direction to what I need to be doing. This is the second level. Okay, what was the one in? What was the rooftop then, Wind? Because uh, we had the museum and then we had the rooftop. So, like, wh how is that? How is this the second level? End of the museum. Right, but it had its own splash screen and everything. That's what I mean. It isn't qualified as a level, though. Okay. Oh god. Where's the door? Off to Stella's guide. <laughs> Do it. I don't know where else to go, though. I, I, I didn't see the point in this entire segment, actually. I think it might have just been there to give you an item or something. Um, I might be best going back. But where? Oh, fuck. Am I right? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, uh, actually, I inspected the entire of this area, didn't I? So, that's all right, Rapier Man. I recently saved. If I die, then I'm just earning a bunch of medkits back, I suppose. So. Oh, fuck. Right, so this is the third level wind. Yeah, the rooftop is cl cl uh, classified as its own level. I can say it did have its own splash screen and everything, like I said, so... Uh, we never went down into that room, I think. How on earth do we get down there? There's so many questions. So, do not go through that door there. Yes, I am on the subway. This is the subway bonsai.
Yeah, short level in Tomb Raider 3. Oh god. Yeah, I remember this area, because I remember this guy prating about at the top here. Do you want to drop dead, please? Ah, fuck, I nearly died there. Not quite, though. So, going down here results in a place that I couldn't get back up from. So I don't want to go through there just yet. Instead, I want to go this way. I think. No? No. Oh god, I don't remember. Oh, yeah. Just... No, this is back to where... Oh, damn it. I don't know where to go. I am genuinely lost. Uh, I don't know which one, Bonsai, I'm afraid. One of those. Alright, don't spoil it. I now know that the next level is on a runaway train. Uh, go to platform 2 door all the way down uh, and right over the trains. Okay. Ma max onto something here. I'm running around like a chicken with his head cut off. Well, do you want me to just stand still instead? That makes for good streaming. Over all the trains. Okay, let's get on top of them instead. There we go. Whoops. Oh, shit! Okay, so much for that. Uh, now where? Uh, have I been here before? This doesn't look too familiar, actually. I failed the one thing that you told me to do. No, I've never been here before. What the heck is this, then? God, whenever I hear that sound, I half expect the, um... What, what is it? Is it Fuse from Streets of Rage 3 to start playing? That's what you should avoid doing. Hey, hey. I do what I like, okay? <laughs> Falling down, I mean. Uh, but, 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 that's where all the fun's at. Uh, at least I have a vague I idea of where I'm supposed to be going. Alright, Spleen, hope you sleep well. Whoops. Oh, god damn, I didn't mean to put that away. Well, this takes time. Maybe she used the shotgun instead. Oh god, right, uh, oh, shit, I missed something. Okay, that's fine, actually, we're back on top of the trains again, I think. I could be wrong, but... I, I, I think it is, uh, Rapier Man, but it, it, it uh... We were saying it, it's kind of, oh, for god's sake, I did exactly the same thing again. I need to be a bit slow at that, or at least jump at the right time. Um, yeah, we were saying the zombies in this seem a little bit out of place in terms of their animation and everything. What? You wanna fight? I'll, I'll fight you. Uh, shit. Yeah, I'll, f I'll follow Van Halen's advice, okay. Oh, god damn it. Well, try anyway. Maybe it's best I just walk over there. <laughs> I do want to go outside. Let me out. Uh, right. Okay, let's try this again. Jump. Oh, she can't jump here! Ah, that's what's going wrong. Okay, that makes more sense. So, yeah, you can't jump there because the ceiling's too low. That's the issue. It's not me falling down or anything. Oh, Jen, you're still here. I didn't realize. Take care, Jen. Take... Uh, I'll uh, see you tomorrow, hopefully. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't go up there. You go up, don't we? Yeah, hopefully see you tomorrow. Right, this way. Oh, yes! Okay, thank you, Mac. Yeah, I remember this now. Of course, there was live rails here. What the fuck? <laughs> He's just like... What are you buying? What are you selling? Yeah, this guy we've been looking for the entire time. Matthias. No, no, not quite. No welcome, stranger. Pino. Glad to see you made it, Miss Croft. Jane sent word that you were coming. Well, what the- how the fuck did- okay. Someone got down here faster than- yeah, even Laura looks shocked. She's like, excuse me? Someone's better at this game than I am? Mr. Lamer. 
or Lamar, I don't know. Uh, what were those creatures back there? Were they the Bacor? Oh, yeah, I Bob Geldof. <laughs> More like Gandalf. Those creatures were zombies. The sword can be used to raise the dead. It seems the Bacor are trying to restore their leader. Per Pervax or something like that, because you have been marked. They will try to use your body as a vessel. He had a stroke. <laughs> Lamore. Okay, so I prefer, I'm going to call him Lamore. I've discovered that they have warehouses at the harbor. If you can find out where they are going, we can get the sword. I do not have any equipment here. You will need to infiltrate the warehouses and use theirs. This train will take you there. Here, let, let, let me pull this for you. My pixely face. I will start the power for the train. Once I throw this switch, you can only stop the train in the front carriage. Hurry! You will not have much time. Oh god, have I got to do that? Oh, I didn't save. I will, Pino. And thanks. Oh no! God damn it, Chrysus. Oh, okay, there's a save point here. There we go. We're, we're gonna do this next time. I'll do this tomorrow. Okay. This was fun! I really enjoyed this. Uh, I, I'm liking this game a lot so far. Two minutes, yeah, two minutes thirty, Jesus. Yeah, this has been a lot of fun so far. Uh, definitely an improvement on the first game. From what I could see so far, I mean, um, yeah, uh, uh, it's utilizing the previous system rather nicely overall. That's uh, alright, Chris, it's just abandon future, so, yeah. Thank you so much for joining me, guys, and, uh, well, I'll see you tomorrow, hopefully. Thank you to everyone who's donated today. Um, yeah, huge thank you to Koso and Jen. I believe that's everyone who's donated, yeah. Uh, we are over the amount that we raised last year. Um, I cannot tell you how impressed I am. Thank you. My internet has no issues with that. <laughs> no, please stay. I need my single viewer. Yeah, uh, we'll be starting at 7pm again tomorrow, continuing this game. 7pm uh, GNT, and uh, Saturday, of course, we'll be doing Tomb Raider 2 on the dance pad. And then finally, on Sunday, we'll be doing Shadow of the Tomb Raider. So, yeah. Don't forget, guys, The uh, you can enter the raffle. You don't need to donate just by being here today. You're more than welcome to, so there you go. Uh, let me just get a link for you guys on YouTube as well. It's a secret, though. You can't tell anyone. Otherwise, you get banned immediately. There we go. Oh, thank you, Wind, as well. Yeah. So, yeah, hopefully uh, see you tomorrow. Let's... Uh Let's do a...